another day, another stream, another opportunity to show off how stupid I am. I don't want to be rude, but if you think that's a moan, you've probably never touched a woman before. <laughs> Sorry, that was really mean. D4! Thank you for the 22... Uh, for the 22 months. Shenpai rolled a nat 1 on intelligence. Yes. The intelligence. Hi, new here? Uh, hi, new. Welcome to the stream. Why is there so much stuff in Act 1? There's so much stuff in this entire game. You'd be surprised. New here? Is that a French name? Probably. You probably uh, say it with New It. No, wait, that's. Why did I just kind of like turn into like a British child? Um, Nuer. Oi, are you New It? <laughs> My water, you're welcome. You do it, and I have a bottle of water. <laughs> yep. Oh, water. <laughs> it's not, it's not, it's not. Oh yeah, Bomb Rush Cyberfunk came out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was actually a pretty good British accent. It's like the only things I can say. There's like nothing else. I'm not very good at doing voices. Or well, accents. I can't do, uh, I can't. see you, it's already, it's failing. I'm failing, I'm falling apart, I'm dying. I'm dead. <laughs> I, I just died. Hey, glad to see you as cheerful as ever. I'm having a good time. <laughs> this calypso's minging. <laughs> minging. I rolled an int. Uh, no, it's it's not an int check. It's an it's a performance check. My performance is at a minus ten. It's fucking minging. Suck your dad. So are we loving a starry in here? You will not find well, I mean I can't I can't say that. I I would like to hope I can take the title of thirstiest for a starian. Well, not even not even true. I'm just like I, every time I just like I'm thinking about a starian with Voxer, I'm like, I'm like wiggling the the, what do you call those the the cheerleader things around? V O X E R, Voxer! <laughs> like, yippee! <laughs> my pom poms, yeah. I'm like wiggling my pom poms around. <laughs> Whenever I see a starian, just stand next to Voxer. I am I f I'm I'm their biggest fan. <laughs> mm. Mm. Ew. <laughs> 
<laughs> um... It's true, darling. Thank you so much for the 33 months. I appreciate it. Uh, this game aids to my bisexual crisis, and I do... Oh, don't. Like it. Uh, I do like it. I... I mean... At first it was only Karlak and Astarian. And now I see Shadowheart and I'm like, ah, fuck! <laughs> God damn it! How did this happen? <laughs> Dude, I liked Shadow Heart this entire- well, not at the beginning of the game, I didn't like her too much, I but like... Now I'm just like massively in love with her. Shadowheart's not a tsundere. Not everything needs to be called a tsundere. Th that, that word literally annoys me. Gross. Get your anime bullshit out of here. What? Next thing you're gonna say, oh, Voxer and Astarian are yaoi. And one is the seme and one is the, the, the uke. <laughs> Huh, you wanna come with these terms? You better fucking swing, dude. <laughs> that literally hurt my brain. It kinda hurt to say, I'm gonna be honest. Seme Uke, your age is showing. I was on DeviantArt, please. Listen, as a fucking idiot, I used to, I used to just... I, I, I would make a drawing of Vox and be like, oh, isn't he okay? Just because, like, I was like, oh, yeah, that means cute. <laughs> now he is a true okay. <laughs> I love how sweetly Voxer's holding that rat. I wish that was me. Who? Voxer or the rat? <laughs> Who are you? What do you mean? <laughs> I wish I was a rat. Don't worry, you don't have to wish for it, you already are. Well, I mean, most of the people in my chat are rats. There, they're coming to rat jams. Dude, okay, I need to talk about this because, um... I can't physically not go through it again. Yesterday after stream, I decided to do a little like check over of my items and stuff in the game. Um, and I was just like doing a once over, looking at everything was fine. Voxer still hasn't gotten any shoes. He's just, he's, he, he has his dogs out now. Um, but I made a mistake. I made a really bad mistake. And... I was basically... How's it called? So, whenever you... Open up the dialogue choice with what with the person that you're romancing, there is... It, there is like the, oh, can I kiss you option, and then right underneath it is the, I think we have to call it quits option. And I was just speed clicking through it. And I accidentally clicked on the, uh, we have to call it quits with Astarian. And my entire heart shattered into a million fucking pieces. 
No, once you, the, the funny part is once you click it, it's over. Like you can't you, the, the the relationship is done. You can't even back out of it anymore. It's just like you have three options and then the relationship is over and your character goes back to just being a friend. And no, there's no are you sure. It's just like you press on it and it's over. And the voice lines that Astarian ha like Astarian has Asterian God damn it Ast Asterian there we go. <laughs> My fucking English is bad. Astar I'm sorry, give me a moment. I'm think I'm having a heart attack. Um but the voice lines that Astarian has are really fucking sad. Um because This is the screenshots that I got. Um, basically, I I was like, I was curious, even though it hurt my fucking soul, because the first line was like, I think you're not ready for a relationship yet towards a starian. Um, and because, like, all he cares about is obviously getting rid of his problem. He's, like, on revenge path towards Kazador. Um... And when you say that, his response is, Would I were, it's true you don't deserve this facade any longer. From the start, I was rather counting the hours until it was going to end. Midnight chimes, eh? <laughs> Which means that he was, like, actually genuinely ready or counting down when this happiness would end. As if he doesn't deserve it. And then when you choose the second option, which is like mean, it's kind of like mean saying that this isn't what I expected of our relationship. Um, he actually says a sentence that kind of ruins me. And I think everybody who chooses this deserves to burn in hell. <laughs> No, just kidding. But he responds with... He quite literally responds with, I was beginning to believe someone truly wanted me, but I shouldn't have deluded myself. And I just stared at my screen in absolute disbelief. And I was just like, no! What?! He's so broken! God! It's- it's not even- because, like, my br I'm- the reason why I think it's so important- Okay, so something that you need to know about me is that when I hyperfixiate on a character, I dissect them to, like, the barest minimum. Like, I- I literally deconstruct characters because I love- what do you call it? I love analyzing characters a lot. And- with everything that he tells you, it is so fucking sad because Astarian actually doesn't know how to properly love someone because all he's been doing for like 200 years is trick people against his will and not actually love anybody. So when he finally has the chance to, he doesn't fucking know what to do with it. Because it's all alien, and it's making me go insane! Like, ah! <laughs> it kind of also makes sense that he's, like, not so interested in sex, either. Because he doesn't... That's all he ever did for two millennia. And I'm just like, I'm... He breaks me. I... I... I'm scared of his conclusion in this goddamn game. 
I'm genuinely scared of this game. I'm scared of everybody's, like, uh, centuries, sorry, yeah, centuries, not millennia. Um, sorry, I, 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 I confuse those very often. Um, I'm genuinely scared of every character's, like, development. Like, genuinely, even Lazel. I don't know what to make of this game. I don't know where it's going. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm scared of Gale. Uh, Gale's, like, showing power hunger problems right now. Astarian's showing, like, drunken revenge problems. Karlak also is on revenge path. All of my characters are going insane! Ah! I'm so scared, man. <laughs> but I am so deeply in love with this game. I'm just scared of finishing it. Well, it, it <clears throat> the problem is that Shadow Heart still isn't healthy. Shadow Heart's like entire path is one of deceit. She believed a god that saved her for years and then it turns out that god fucking lied to her and literally took her away from her family early on and then turned her into a slave pretty much and i'm sitting there like <laughs> you know it's like <laughs> And yeah, then you have Lazel, the Githyanki being born to be turned into soldiers. And having people, like, having her tribe tell her that they are above everybody that exists. And then finding out that your fucking god is a lich queen. What the fuck? <laughs> her entire worldview got flipped upside down and i'm sitting there like wow the message of this game really is that authority figures suck <laughs> baldur's gate 3 says a <laughs> cab fuck the government which is, like, I guess why I'm even more immersed with Voxer being the character. <sighs> Sorry. I'm just swooning over the game. <laughs> I think you'd like One Piece. No, I'm good. I'm just, I, yeah, I'm also like, I'm actually genuinely glad I did make Voxer in the end. I don't think I would have been in into this game as hard as I would be if it wasn't Voxer. There is a possible result to Asterion's quest that I think you absolutely want to avoid. Um, well, gonna be honest, um, nah, let me suffer. <laughs> no, I don't, I, I already said multiple times I'm not getting into One Piece. And I'm sorry, the length of it definitely has something to do with it. I'm 
No, it's okay. I, I, I understand where your worry is coming from. Um, deep down, I want to heed the warning, but I also feel like maybe I should experience it and just deal with the consequences. If it's really bad, I'll probably just reload. The length each episode feels like 10 seconds. Oh boy. Oh my god. Move on! I gave you my answer. Deal with it. Ah. What is your opinion on the Dragonborn design in this game? Uh, hold on, let me, um... I was editing my, my Baldur's Gate video and I have the perfect clip for you. Hold on, I need to find it. Oh yeah, I've I've already uploaded all of the VODs. I just need to make the thumbnails and then put them live. I've just, I haven't had the time. As you guys know, I'm currently editing all of my videos myself because I, I'm not doing bad with money. I'm okay with money. I just can't afford, like, the things that make it easier. I can't fully pay my editors. Um, without kind of like ending up in a tricky situation, so I have to do all the work myself. Um, I do all of my editing, I do full-time streaming, I work on a webcomic that I upload every month for free. For free. It's a lot to- it's a lot to balance. If I'm a little slow in one regard, it's just because I'm overwhelmed with work and I'm trying not to have a mental breakdown. <laughs> Here, let me give you a little insight of uh, of how my uh, how the editing process went. Here, it might lag a little bit, by the way. So, uh, yeah, I'm 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 working on it. I'm editing it down. But this is what I can tell you about uh, all of the ca character creator. Hold on here. I don't know, this kind of serves. There's a lot going on here. Oh god. <sighs> Sorry, hi, I'm good. Qua, 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 qua. Oh, yep. Yeah, baby. Woo! I love women. No, guys, I can't be stuck in here for too long. <laughs> there you go. That's, that's my answer. <laughs> I hope the uh, the loud screaming gave you my my answer. <laughs> yeah, no, I I love the also. There's something about the Dragonborn. They look really good in cutscenes. Like. I'm playing a Dragonborn with Volpixie right now, uh, of a uh, Dragonborn uh, Paladin. And they look so good in cutscenes. And also their eyes are gorgeous. I, yeah, I was stuck in character creator for I think about two hours before I finally managed to make Voxer.
Yeah, yeah, the, the, the dragonborns are gorgeous. I Sometimes I look at Vox, so I'm just like, you're so ugly. <laughs> No, he's pretty? I can't get the Skrillex comment out of my mind, dude. I can't. I, I can't. It's he's been kind of ruined for me. I love Skrillex Elf. Fair. Hmm. What's that? The Sword of the Emperor. My own sword. My first purchase as an adventurer. No use to me anymore. It's yours if you want it. Okay, but he looks good with a Starian. They're also oh my god. My god! My entire party serves cunt! <laughs> we have Voxer in this beautiful little dress. Uh, with it. then we have Shadow Heart showing off them titties! Um Karlak just really God. I. These four bad bitches walk up to you. What do you do? What's the sword in Astarian? Um, he has two. He has the Knife of the Undermountain King, and he has the Stillmaker. To die? Oh. The home of all my disguises. We are what we appear to be, and so appearances matter. Cerebral Citadel Armor. Well, problem is... Uh, none of us can wear it. Also, oh, I'm about to hit the cap. Time to send some things to my... Uh... Hold on, I need to, I need to manage my inventory. I didn't mean to equip the Sword of the Emperor. Why have I, why have I equipped it? This- I don't trust the Emperor. I don't trust him. I- I still don't. Everybody's like, oh Shen, but he's like, he's not that bad. I'm like, I don't trust him. I don't trust him. I don't. There is something going on and it bothers me. And usually when when I, I I I have a sensor. And when that sensor goes off, I don't trust it. Oh no, those are just normal boots. Damn. Voxer, why do you why how did I get rid of your shoe? I Alright, I donated them to the fucking statue. Um God damn it. We need to find Boxer new shoes. He's just walking around with his dogs out. Actually, Karlak, uh, for you it makes sense. Give me those loafers. <laughs> That's curious. Butler fork. My cutlery set. A gift from my mother. The butter knife is missing, but otherwise it looks to be complete. I don't need it anymore, but the memory stirs something in me still. D do you want me to grab it? It's mine now. Okay, here. You can have your, uh, your little memory sphere back. I want to put- there. Anatomy of a Mind Flare. 
Insights gleaned from research. Mind flayers must consume the brains of humanoids in order to stay alive. It is said that the act of devouring a humanoid brain results in a state of euphoria and contribution to the thin glaze of mucus that coats a mind flayer's skin. Some researchers go so far as to claim that it is possible to deduce how recently another mind flayer fed and indeed the health of its victim from the vis vis viscosity of that mucus. Little is known about what a mind flayer's brain contains. Some have argued that their skulls are filled with eggs that will later become the tadpoles with which they enthrall their victims. Others propose that the brain is in fact a cluster of pure cerebral nerves. The mind flayers procreate by tadpoling humanoids. They technically have no of genitals, but I have been unable to verify this in the absence of any written record. God Christ. That might be worth a look. There she is, in all her glory. Duke Bellin Stelmay. My own partner. I don't want to think about... Soldier. Hi, how's it going? I don't like to think about uh, mind flare genitalia if I'm honest. That's a carrot. All right, bestow curse. Turn on that light. That might be worth a look. Ooh. I can't. Damn, Boxer, are you stupid? Can you not read? A recipe for fiddlehead soup. A favorite meal of mine. When I had need of meals like that. An old container for brains. Empty. Shame. It would have been nice to find one to sustain you. Just, uh, just, uh, I don't like. Th He's getting sentimental on me. He needs to shut up. Stupid. Hmm. What's that? What did you find? The chains I use to buy my meals. Villains and lawbreakers. You see, I tried to exercise morality. Where I could. Yet you still killed people and ate their fucking brains! Ah, you're still a mind flare! Ah! Please tell me you have shoes here. Please. Oh my god! Thank you! Alright, here, you can have your shoes back. Thank god. Voxer, no, you're stuck. Oh, well, I guess that's fine. All right, let's go. Okay. A map of the Sword Coast from the Sea of Moving Ice down to just north of Anne, including several of the nearest archipelagos in the Sea of Swords. A map of Baldur's Gate depicting Upper City, Lower City, and Outer City as far as Worms Crossing, as well as Grey Harbor and the near course of Tunthar. Gold! That's mine. More gold! Mine. 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 Oh! Breezy sandals. Wait, you can't reach that? Fuck! Um... Come on! Oh, okay. What is this? The tech thoughts. A journalist stamp with the official seal of Duke Bellim Stillmane. Shen, I love your voice. I listen to your vods at night and the... And the what? <laughs> and the what? <laughs> 
Can't explain the relapse. Duke lacks uh, app. Oh, I fucking accidentally hit off a key on my goddamn. Uh, are interested in anything? Occasionally ask after visit, which I suspect might be the cause of current condition. Duke used to receive visitors in private every ten day, always hooded and cloaked, always shown in and left to attend Duke privately. No luck in finding, oddly enough. Can't recall visitors' gender or even stature. Could be half orc or halfling, for all I know. Hoping for their return, this has appeared to ease the Duke's mind and body greatly. All right, for those that weren't here yesterday, did you know that we fought a fucking dragon? Well. Careful, I bind. Simple. Yep, we fought a dragon. And oh, oh! For those that still don't know, the emperor. The emperor who is in our fucking brain all the time is actually Baldurin. Welcome to this fuckery! <laughs> Baldrin, the creator of Baldur's Gate. Baldrin of Baldur's Gate. What the fuck is this? Hello? Why is there noxious fumes here? What did you do? Will the mage hand die? Many a oh no, the mage hand is fine. All right, what do we have here? Can I? Ha ha! I am the smartest! Yippee! God. You can praise me now. You can call me smart and beautiful. And the best. Still alive. So that's progress. It gives I'm gonna give the mage hand a little snack. How much bother can and I a do? handshake. So there's two areas where we can actually jump up on. Um we're gonna have to leave a Starion behind, which sucks. Uh Sorry, Astarian. What the fuck? I had entered by accident? <laughs> oh! Whew. Oh, Christ. Quick, go back in the hole. Jump. What? It's fine. You can just take two damage. Are you guys going to come or, or not? Now nah, you guys can stay over there. Where does this take you? Interesting. Anything over here? Oh, this wall is breakable. Hiya! <gasps> Fuck. Okay, what if we throw a bomb? Wait, I know who has a bomb. There we go. Here, you can have, uh... The Silk Root? There it is. Nice! The what the what? Listen, 
Huh? Oh my god, I didn't know these areas existed! Ha! Huh. Something over there. Really? Thank you, Starion. <laughs> awesome, cool, I appreciate it. What the fuck is happening here? What are you guys... What are you shooting? Hello, fellas? Don't mind me, just coming through. What's this? A heretic in our midst. I can't hear you! We're gonna move over here. And we're gonna jump. And we're gonna yump. And we're gonna... Yup. Nice. And we're gonna... Yup. Oh, what the fuck? Why did you only take a damage? Okay. Ooh! Nothing will stand in my way. How about we make it easier? Wait, the path is interrupted. That should work. Okay, and sorry, Carlac. Oh, oh, hey, how's it going? How's it going, friends? Whoa! <gasps> hey, I know that Vox is standing there. But, do something really funny. <laughs> He's fine. Here, we can make it better by healing him. Here you go. <laughs> ah, ah. Let's find some prey. And now, hit you. Oh my god! Astarian is so scary, dude! Perhaps the only way out is through. Come here! Mm. Nice, good job, everybody. Not all too scary, honestly. Ah, uh, that was lame. They don't have anything nice. A murderous cut. What was that? What's going on down here? There's a door? There's dead people? Seems about right? Dude, Rogue, Rogue Astarian is actually like, like when you get those like, those sneak attacks off, it's actually Kind of insane and kind of terrifying. Okay, we don't need to go over here. I don't think there is anything. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't check that person out. Okay. The true and impossible injuries of ten. Okay, we already read that. Well, it's sad that these people died. 
But it's awesome that I got loot. Anyways, ooh, a lever. Oh, is the... The fumes are gone, but, like, what is over there? I don't think there is anything over there. I guess not. Time to go through the door! Oh! Oh, they're dead! All of them are dead? Oh yeah, hey, um, shit. Voxer, you're gonna have to look ugly for a little bit. There we go. Now we can see. Ooh. Keep a blade close. Oh, there we go. <gasps> Ooh! Sitting around. Let's go hurt someone. Step carefully. There's a trap. Okay, let's not go that way then. Oh, wait! It's Voss! Let's go. Um. Hi, boss. By the glory of Mother Gith, tell me you've taken the Orphic Hammer. No. Ah, you finally come. Have you retrieved the Orphic Hammer? Will our prince's chains finally be broken? Ah. Uh. The remaining honor guard serve as my eyes and ears. Vlakith's forces hunt you and the prism. My allies have slayed more than you know. So that you might travel freely. Okay. As for those that break through, you've proven more than capable of bleeding them yourself. Someone made a really horrible observation about this guy, and they said he looks like the Grinch. Hello, who are you? Hey there. Hi! Ah, a friendly face at last. Are you going to the party as well? W what, uh, a party in the sewers? I know, a bit strange, isn't it? But then you have to be open to trying new things. The venue's called The Palace. Not sure what it stands for, but it sounds very exclusive. Ah. Uh... My date's supposed to meet me here, but there's no sign of him. You haven't seen him, have you? Pale, skinny, extremely piercing eyes. Looks a bit like your friend here. <sighs> oh dear. I assure you, it's not. Oh? It's funny. He was ever so keen for me to come. He didn't seem the type to cancel. <laughs> oh. oh okay a vampire sorry yeah, sorry was he but then why am i still here he could have had me by the neck anytime he liked mother may i i'm positively starved ah <sighs> You think something's happened to him? Oh, I'd imagine so. There's no way he'd leave someone as appetizing as you alone. A story. You know what? I might give this party a miss. Plenty more fish in the Chionthar, as they say. I know you're mad at me for if saying that, him, but come on! Don't tell him I was here. Just tell him I... Um, really? I wasn't ready to be in a relationship. I'm sure he'll understand. Really?! Is there something you want to talk about? Yes! What the fuck was that? Babe, I 
game, I'm right here! <laughs> A smudged charcoal rendering of a smiling young girl. Missing. Tessa. Uh, reward offered for any information on belov beloved child. Grateful to receive that girl encampment in Worms Crossing. Well, he it's true. He he knows what vampires do. He was he was literally doing Casador's bidding. He should know. He's different. <laughs> Astarian's different. He wouldn't, right? <laughs> Not willingly. <laughs> okay, thank God. I was about to be like, really? He's so, he's so dramatic. Don't listen to him. <laughs> he's sensitive. get over it. Although, what happens if you... Actually, no, let's just disarm it. I'm not... I don't... I don't trust it. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, Astarian, do you want to do me the, uh, the honor? With pleasure. Bloody theater majors? They're so dramatic. What's the party layout? What do you mean, what's the party layout? We have two barbarians who together have minus five brain cells. We have a very fruity uh, theater major, and then we have Shadowheart. Something's on my mind. Hello, rat. We see, we know. You see, you know what? Oh, what the? It's great. What's this, cousin? Another absolutist come to see what we did to poor old Sarin. Your god took her mind, cultist, so Bereki took her head, and I burned the flesh from her bones. And now you come to interrupt the funeral rites. I... Um... Yes, cousin. An excellent idea. Cousin says we will take you in return. He says you look just like kindling for Sarin's funeral pyre. What the fuck are you talking about? <sighs> Who are you? I've gotten, I have gotten the slightest idea who or what you're talking about. Of course you don't. Sarin, Bereki, and I made our coin by going unnoticed. The finest thieves in the city. Until we messed with Gortash and he sent the cult after us. Your fellow cultists hunted us, so we hid down Oh here. shit, they think we're... We were safe, and so was our loot. Until the darkness soured Sarin's mind. She kept our treasure from us. Said Bereki and I had gone strange. Hi, Grease Elemental. Hush, cousin. Sarin turned into a cultist herself, so we did what we had to. Bereki wept until his voice was gone, and then he was gone too, leaving only me to conduct Sarin's rites. And my cousins here. You cannot conduct the rites without a clan to bear witness. Or some fuel for the fire. I still have no clue what you're talking about. Uh, yeah. Uh, we're probably gonna have to fight here.
Uh, fuck. Oh! Whoa! Okay! She swore she was no cultist, but you all lie. The absolute turns you. I don't know. I don't know. Pass then, and do not come back. This is Sarin's final resting place and a killing ground for all who come to disturb her. Yay. Oh, we're all green now. What are we supposed to be doing? You guys are fucking loud. Is is my spear? Is my spear the thing that's making all the enemies enemies like visible? Or like all the characters? Whoa, that's a lot of dudes. Yeah. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm glad to have some. It's a keybind. Wait, what is it? Oh, thanks. Okay. Hello, little rat. Mm. What's that? Oh, another stone. Incompleted journal. A hastily scrawled journal entry apparently lost us uh, in a series. Alice Bereki, don't be mad if you find this, boys. I'm not trying to keep the treasure from you. We just ripped off Gortash. And if you know. You two at all, you're going to spend it all in the one spot and draw the bastard Archduke to be his notice. Before you protest, remember Taluk's bakery, Yearns back. I'm doing my best to it all to the fist, and you two don't even bother to wash the cake from your grobs. So if you found this, that means I'm off doing my business in the tunnels. So put it back and pretend you never saw it like a sweet little deers. And wipe your faces, Sarin. Damn. Where the fuck are we? We're in the Undercity Ruins. Okay. Hey there. Penitent looks at you silently. Expectantly. Uh... You're running a shop here, are you? Penitent doesn't respond, holding your gaze almost unblinkingly with his. There is the slightest flicker of acknowledgement in his eyes. Oh! Armor of Moonbasking. Lunar Bestial Vitality. Oh! Okay, so that's for druids. Bone Spike Helmet. Fury Namara. When you rage, hostile creatures in a three meter radius must succeed a wisdom saving throw. Yes, please. Ah. Uh. Thank you. Penitent blinks. You think? There's nothing else. And we got a cool item out of it. Let's go. Uh, where's the helmet? So I can equip it. Let's see how Fucking stupid we look. <laughs> yup. That's about what I expected. Open up. Passageway. Where are we? Hello? Um... This is a 
trap. This is absolutely a trap. Ancient Servant. Oh. Zombies. Um, 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 um. Now they see me. Or not. Mm. No. Feel that anguish. <laughs> nice. Okay. Ah, oh, ga 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 ga. Want another? Oh shit. Nice. Ooh, creepy little crawly hands. Welcome to Elden Ring, by the way. Necro what? Take two, two, oh shit! Okay, I should have probably read that. Wait, what? Why do you do we have that beat debuff? Why does everybody but a Starian have it? Well, I guess we have to fight this without spells. Ah. Oh, true. Right, never mind. You're probably right about the vampire thing. Damage. Yeah. <laughs> Such a gentle poke. Just like old times. Nice. This is gonna feel good. Uh Wait, let's get rid of the hand. There we go. Okay. Okay. Ouch. Um. Uh, potions don't count, right? Yeah. Oh, she needs to. She needs to battle with her with her weapon. Hey, yeah. Is that a spell? No? Okay. Well! Ouch. I think Shadow- I think sh I think she's gonna go down. Ah! 
okay, 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 okay. And one more time. Oh God. Hey, how's it going? Um. Ah shit. Okay. This. Uh. Oh wait, this. Okay, that's not a. Oh jeez. Well. Nice. And there we go. Wait, that. That was active? Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. This is why it's suddenly good to have two barbarians. They do. They are the ones with the biggest damage. Oh God! It's okay. It's okay. She'll be fine. Yeah, I can't imagine being a sorcerer and going here is a fun time. I respect having Shadowheart still in the domain of trickery. Wait, what do you mean? In the domain of trickery? I don't- I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what any of that means, so I am big stupid. like that. Oh, I should probably change that, shouldn't I? Is she- does that make her worse currently? I don't know. User things? I have no fucking clue what you mean by user things. Okay, nice. No, that's not Good, close enough. Hot in here. By the way, Milky, who do you have in your uh, in your party? I assume you have uh, you have Lazelle in there. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. She's okay. Shadowheart and Lazel. Damn. The only one that we share is Shadowheart. <laughs> it's okay. This is why having two barbarians is really funny. To be honest. Keep them guessing. Wait, what? Path is interrupted? Wait, oh, never mind. Time for a new. There we go. <laughs> Time to smack some bitches. Hiya! Ouch! That was close. Breaching Pike staff. Bungabunga barbarian time. 
Why do I always get all of the staffs? I want axes, not staffs. An ancient stone, cold and damp to the touch, the letters carved on its surface appear to have been drawn by a clumsy and laborious hand. Where is he? Where is he? Promised life, eternal life, glory, riches. Where is he? I don't fucking know. Huh. I'll give it a shot. Fading fast. It'll nice be fine. Healing. An ancient stone, cold and damp to the touch, though the letters carved on it are archaic in form, it is recognizable as the common tongue. The high priest uh, continues to sicken in spite of the Chirurgian's... Tur Chirurg Chirurg um. I fear each breath might be his last, but with every exhalation, he whispers to me of a means by which he might live on to walk among us still. He does not speak of the method, but I am sure it is a reliable one. He Has he not performed uh, such miracles for others in the name of our necromantic purpose? Has he not adorned himself with the jewels of his powers or death? Were he to succeed, what wealth, what further fortune might he draw to our glorious worship? He even offers me, a mere acolyte, the honor of sharing this golden immortality with him. I dare not refuse. I cannot afford to. I like that we're all suffering and Astarians just standing there like <laughs> Why are you s Why are you suffering? Just purely don't <laughs> Cause you're beautiful. Thanks, I love you. Anyways. Yeah, it's literally just a skill issue. Hello, Shen. How are you this day? Wait, did I already open that? No, I didn't. Right? There we go. I don't think I'm missing anything else. That one wasn't opened. This one wasn't opened. I don't think the NP the enemies like avoided a Starion. I think one of the undeads was actually trying to go for him, but um it's just that it was easier to hit the others. Alright, I guess this is it for here. I don't know what the blue on the map is. Wait. There we go. Fuck you and your curse. I'm out of here. Oh. Oh. Oh wait, this is gorgeous. What? This is what camp looks like? Here? Wow. I want to jump on on the boat and die. No. <laughs> now we're in Baldur's Gate. Oh look, the two are hanging out. Will, can you stop being broken? Let's talk. Okay. Are you done? F oh, God damn it. Hi, Halson. I received a dispatch from the Grove. Life carries on there in our absence, just as nature intended. My chosen successor, Francesca, has proven to be a wise choice. Perhaps the wisest I ever made as Archdruid. Uh, what's the news from the Grove? The Shadow Druids. Their scheming was stopped, thanks to you. Yet their malign ideals can find purchase and live on. Even after the instigators themselves are vanquished. 
Francesca has found some initiates still yearn for the false promises the Shadow Druids peddled. She has been working hard to show them the error of their ways. She is well suited to the task. Better than I, perhaps. To cleanse a land of shadows is one thing. But to sway a heart from a dark path is another matter entirely. I was all too eager to surrender my responsibilities towards the Grove. Perhaps I was never meant to be Archdruid, to be a leader. You serve the Grove well and found a worthy successor. No one can ask more of you. Still, though, I cannot help but wonder if there was more I could have done. Perhaps, Oak Father willing, I may yet have the chance someday. Forgive me. The Shadow Curse occupied me so entirely and for so long, I almost missed the purpose it gave me. Now I must find a new one. Okay. I've been unfair to you. I've had unrealistic expectations of your character ever since I joined you. But honestly, you've surpassed even those. Seems my faith was more than well founded. Oh, thanks. That's so sweet. Almost pleasant traveling with company. If you fine. What's on your mind? How are you holding up? All right, you already said this to me. Don't be so modest. I can't remember. She's so cute. And oh my God, she looks so fucked up. What happened to you? Ah, look at them. Red and blue. <laughs> Christ. Wait, you guys need to swap your tents. Are you guys best friends now? Gosh, you're beautiful. Yes, thanks. I appreciate it. How can I help? Oh, okay. You have nothing new to say. All right. What's in here? Hello? Ah. Okay. Hey, Karlak. I need a moment for the two of us. What's on your mind? Uh, nothing, I guess. All right, let's sleep. Hey, Will. Ah, God! Hi. I forgot you were supposed to come here. What do you want? Ah, Christ. Come, sisters, be my testament. No tomb sit in Beator. No tomb sit in Beator. You've heard of such devils. Sisters of justice, adjudicators of diabolical contracts and bargains. Holy hells. Uh. Interesting. I don't recall sitting on Vegas' sister of you justice. You do not call upon the sisters. They come when the hells demand witness. Enough, Mesora. Where is my father? How do I save him? How else we bargain? Sisters. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Oh, damn it. Your contract, Will. Signed in blood, forged in fire, bound in bone, but not unbreakable. Then break it already. Will doesn't need to wait six no months. No contract is ended without sacrifice. A cost must be paid. 
Oh god damn it. Will Raven Guard. A choice is before you. Option one. I show you the way to your father. I guarantee him no harm except that from you and your allies. And you pledge your soul to me and the Archdevil Zariel in a pact eternal. Uh -huh. Option two. I break your pact and you are freed from your duty. Your father dies by his enemy's hand, and Baldur's Gate loses. He's its fucking devil champion. Name your sacrifice. Bloody Zariel. I won't let her take Will. Silence, Karlak. Mizora, you asshole. Choose. Uh. Addendum F. The Absolute must be avenged for the Soulbinder's detention at Moonrise. The Soulbearer retains his gifts until such time as the Absolute is slain. Why do I make the decision for him? That's not something I'm supposed to do. That's not on me. Oh man, dude. Oh, maybe if I don't know Will enough for to, for him to have this choice. Christ. You damned wretch. Father. Um, Do it. Break the pack. Uh, bye, Will. I don't know where he is, but he's gone. Fiat Ita. Fiat Ita. Anima Ad. Oh, no gates is balder than bald. Didn't think you had it in you. Seems my boy's all grown up. And don't go fussing about your father. You made your choice. You knew the terms. You know what? I think I'll stick around. Not for the greater good, you understand. Just for the entertainment. Ah. What's on your mind? Well, I... Uh, we didn't have a choice. Oh, you're just gonna hang around here. Just like that. Just like that. You bitch. Gods. I spent seven years choked by Mazura's leash. And I spent seven years hoping to break free. I never knew freedom could taste so bittersweet. I have to believe that. I'm not the Hell's puppet in life, nor its warrior in death. The Blade will be guiding his own hand, but freedom will be paid in my father's blood. Tomorrow, I celebrate my gain. Today, I mourn my loss. A moment passes. In the stillness, you find a mote of tranquility. The Raven Guard name now lives solely with me. I will make it count for something. 
I sank his life away before the Hell's witnesses. It would be easier to drink the sticks down to the last drop than to alter his fate. But it can happen. I'd be a fool to wish otherwise. That doesn't mean it can't happen. We obtain the final two nether stones and take back our minds and the city from the brain. Okay. <sighs> Little Will's all grown up. I can't wait to see what trouble he gets into. Our fucking camp is getting... I beg your forgiveness for such undue impertinence. From now on, I promise him the same measure of respect he's shown his father. Oh, I almost forgot. Will sold his father's life for his freedom. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> My mistake. You've left Karlak alone. Didn't you want her dead? What changed? Oh, you are an inquisitive one. I'd have thought you'd figured by now. Zariel found a new use for an old battle axe. The dead three in that bulging brain of theirs are a threat to more than this trifling city, you know. Savor her company. Who's to say when Zariel might uh. change her mind? My mistress can be so capricious. Uh. Just because he's not my pet doesn't mean he's not useful. The Absolutists worked a number on me at Moonrise. And you're the best hope I've got at payback. No one crosses the Hell's children without getting scorched. <sighs> you never told me how the Absolutists captured you. Correct. I didn't. If you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel. But those cursed shadows were thick enough to fell even a half-fiend. I woke in that damned pod. It kept my body sealed and my most powerful magic silenced. But a brave, kind, benevolent soul set me free. I shouldn't have. I should have killed you. Fuck Gallantry you. isn't dead after all. Why? I'm supplying Will with every scrap of his infernal power. I've paid my dues many times over. I tell you what, when the time comes to squish that big baddie of a brain, I'll lend you a hand. Oh, thanks. Cool, I appreciate it. Will sacrificed his own father. I hope freedom from the pact is worth it to him. Oh god, what does Astarian have to say about this? He's gonna say something super snarky. Soldier? Okay, you have nothing to say. his father to have freedom hmm. an understandable decision sacrifices must be made after all especially if the old duke's fall means his rise mm -hmm. okay time and again will's plight reinforces my decision not to pursue the path of a warlock it's one thing to make such a sacrifice in the pursuit of such a pack but to do so in order to escape one Truly, it leaves you with nothing. Yeah. All right, fetch time. Good night, fellas. Okay, that's just ridiculous. The 
say that home is where a person can be ah! themselves. Where are you thinking? Without pretense. You did well to see off the Githyanki who had invaded mine. And now that you have seen where I come from, you know all there is to know about me. At least, all that matters. The ah. flavors of my favorite fiddlehead soup. Should you wish to experience it for yourself. The very first reward I gifted myself on completion of my first adventure. The garments with which I concealed and later constructed my appearance as the Emperor. We spoke of my relationship with Duke Berlin Stillman. A story I have told no one. I have no more secrets from you. No need to resort to subterfuge. We are true allies. I don't trust you! towards a common goal. Mm. The only way we were ever going to get close enough to the brain to destroy it was by working together. But few would trust a mind flare. So I did what I had to to convince you. I studied you. Your motivations, your actions, your desires. I deduced the best way to align your goals with my own. That is so fucking... No. Perhaps, at first. I did consider that you were just a problem to be solved. And not an easy one at that. But I persisted. I needed your absolute dedication to the cause. I anticipated the challenge, and I anticipated your resistance. What I didn't anticipate was how much I would enjoy your company. Load, just so you guys can see it. I don't want it. Would you like that? D I I'm shaking my fucking head. This is a fucking mistake. Just so you guys could see it, uh-huh. Oh, I can say no right now. I can do it right now. I, d I actually don't mind if I miss this. Shen, please. Ugh. Fine. I hate the you guys. The back of your mind warms with a rush of feeling. The Emperor is... <laughs> no! This is weird! <laughs> the ransom. feelings about him.
Sometimes, I felt almost like we would die. I'm sorry. You're right. Now's not the time. I also I have someone. Thank you. Let's move on to more important things. Good. The Elder Brain's hive mind has grown to monstrous proportions. And through the crown's magic, it has complete control over each and every member. It was intelligent before, but now... With its hide mind established across the city, it is well on its way to becoming indestructible. We must stop it while we still can, before we too become its slaves. Okay, goodbye. I need to rinse my brain. Sorry. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? Can you give me a kiss? Uh, can't get enough. Give me a kiss, thanks. I'm happy. This kiss for the squid wanted to fuck me. I do rather like that, you know. Huh. Ugh, I feel weird. Oh, no, I didn't. Wait, if you, wait, hold on. Fun fact, if you fuck them the next day, everybody watch the scene, wait, what? No, no way. whispers fills your mind as you approach yes the it is rife with magic old deathly magic a new vessel brimming with blood darkens Baal's door to baptize his days most holy do you have proof of your faith to our lord are you kidding <laughs> see that hold on i do want to see that but i'm probably gonna skip for the the action i i don't care too much i just want to see the reactions i just don't know how far i can skip without i have i have nudity off yes wait <gasps> no let me check <laughs> actually hold on I hope I do! <laughs> I should! Uh. Oh wait, my autosave is weird. Oh, there we go. It was a different autosave. I know, but I still- I, even if it doesn't show, like, everything, I just need to make sure that, um, it's off. God. I can't believe I'm being forced to actually watch it after all. <sighs> Sometimes. Nightmare. Nightmare, nightmare. I felt almost like we were dancing our way towards something deeper. Oh, okay, they're on. <laughs> oh, God. Would you like that? <sighs> Here you go, chat. The back Ugh. of your mind warms with a rush of feeling. The Emperor's feeling. Heat, God damn it. Care, arousal. I'm... 
I'm, I don't want to look. I don't want- I- I hate this. Every monster fucker is like- I- this is horrible. 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 This is terrible. This is awful. 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 This is terrible. This is disgusting. This is- I don't want to be here. But- Fucking Christ. Ever 
everything you ever dreamt of and more. No! Single greatest experience of your life. Holy shit! Pleasure upon pleasure as mind and body intertwined. Why do it they detail this one so much compared to every other? Began. Jesus fucking th the leaf. You can read the Emperor's expression better now that you've connected on a deeper level. You know it feels the same way. This is... This is horrible. <laughs> it seems that you can you to share more than you can your I said I'd protect you from the absolute, not each other. And I was distracted. Both Druid Sot <laughs> and Gale. It's time to get dressed. We have work to do. Is it random who it chooses? Wait. <laughs> the fucking ass on screen. Nice ass, dickweed. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. I I need to know. <laughs> Can you make it worse? I am tempted, but it will be quite some time before I am. Ah, okay. Able to yeah, do that again. okay. Don't worry. And this is being reloaded. Is <laughs> no! Grow to monstrous proportions. All right, we get me out of here. <sighs> I need to see what they have to. Does the Starian say anything? Is there something you want to talk about? <laughs> no. So it was Gail. <laughs> What's on your mind? They don't, okay, they don't, they don't say anything. Hey, Gail, how was that dream? I did not know Duke Ravenguard that. Okay. I'm sure Will knows that. But we would do All what right. to remind him. All right, let's not, let's not fuck the Emperor. Christ. Don't reload. Keep it. No. Sorry. No. Uh uh. Uh uh. No. Never wanted the easy part. Oh, uh, uh. I know I can't undo the achievement, but it's not real in this timeline. Listen, if the character, if it was like anybody else, I don't feel comfortable with the Emperor. I don't trust him. I don't trust them. I think you loaded the same save. I never, I never saved it. Hold on. Here, I'll make sure. I'll make sure. That's the auto save. That's the quick. Okay, let me do. Let me just make sure we're doing the correct one. Let me make sure we're taking the correct save. I'll, I'll reject him again if I have to. I'll do it.
God. Here. Sometimes I felt there we go. We must. <sighs> We're free. All right, cool. I love that people are trying to tell me what I'm supposed to think about characters. Shut the fuck up. Coward? Um, no. I just want to be, uh, faithful to Astarian. Thanks, though. Back to the door we go. The rush of ancient whispers fills your mind as you approach the door. It is rife with magic. Old, deathly magic. A new vessel brimming with blood darkens Baal's door. To baptize his dais most holy. Do you have proof of your faith to our Lord? Uh. You must bear proof of the Dread Lord's favor, or pay his toll of blood. Wait. Wait, I. I'm so. What, what did she say? The vessel returns, most shamefully unleaking. Prove your faith. You must bear proof of the Dread Lord's favor, or pay his toll of blood. How do I... how do I bleed? There. The vessel. <laughs> Shit, fuck! Maybe here? All right, do it again. Let's get going. I can't target myself. What is what is this? What is that? Skull? Oh, I can't. Oh. How did I've got a long road ahead? Boxers being too harsh and not trusting. Oh my god. Oh, I swear. Ah, I'm getting really f furious. Perceptions failed. Okay.
Oh! One more time. Shit. Path is interrupted. Okay, they're pretty low already. <sighs> um, do we still have Alchemist Fire? I just don't know where it is. Where the fuck is it? I know I saw it earlier. Animal speaking, slumber, fire resistance. Oh, I don't know. I don't know where it is. Fuck. Take it. Get fucked, nerds. And one more time. Oh, this is the dude! Can you reach from all the way over here? No. No, you can't. That doesn't count as an area? <coughs> oh, 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 I thought it did AoE damage. I guess not. I guess I'm wrong. <sighs> okay, Carlac, I need you to do me a favor. Oh damn, she took a lot of damage there. Um What 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 what
Oh god. Oh. 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 Ah, oh, fuck. Um. Ouch. Get fucked, nerd. Step on my feet. Uh Maybe I should. No, this is good. Oh. Restrained? Okay, uh, let's cure wounds on. There you go. Everyone alive. Take your Nice. Ah. We might have to restart. I can't believe that I fucked up boxers so bad. Oh! Do anything. Whoa, seven months. Anyways, Hugh Ushen, what is your opinion on the beloved wet cat of a vampire? I love him. I love him so much. Actually, stay right there. Okay, okay, Shadow Heart will be fine.
Nice. Yeah, I fought this entire battle really wrong. Uh. Oh! I see. We are dead regardless. How awesome. Alright, let's reload. That was, uh, definitely not very good at all. No, sending a Voxer into the pit was not very good. Yeah, it was not very cash money, to be honest, to be fair. Hold on, can we? Hold on. Be on my way. This calls for careful follow. Hold on. I want to see if we can do something with the Starian. Watch your back. Invisible. Trip carefully. Let's go, Starian. You got this. Wait, nobody's here. Hold on. Haha! -ha! Okay, it's just gonna be me and him. Okay. They won't know what bit them. Oh shit, wait. What is he doing? Wait, 
Oh, is it because it's slowed? I see. There we go. There we go. And he can't move. Okay. Leave no trace. Okay, hold on. This is working out actually really nicely. Nice. This is, it's fine, we can just let a star in do this. Already at 28 health. Make it hurt. He's not casting the original thing that he was doing anymore, so like, it's fine. Okay, nice. Ah, Starin will be fine. Are we still slowed? I guess not. All right, time to die. Nice. Cool. Uh, now we have, ah. Uh... Okay. All right, I guess, I guess the enemies aren't there anymore if you defeat them. <laughs> hey, fellas, how's it going? We'll let Astarian do all the fighting. <laughs> well. <laughs> okay. Dude, I love it. I love it. Astarian's so good. Come on, how do we open this? Open your fucking door. Fine, I'll lock pick it. For skeleton key. All right. To rest. What's in here? Hello. Who's hanging out in here? Nothing. Nothing. Hold on. Let me. Let me. There we go. We not. You gotta equip the spear again. Just so we glow. There we go. Nice. I'm just doing it as it's intended. I don't know why it has to be such a fucking topic of discussion to know that I don't trust the Emperor. Especially that I don't want to fuck him. Oh my god! 
Hello? A thrill of fear tingles your spine as you realize that a single mistake will mean that you end up as a hanging target for barless daggers. Well... Uh, st Strangler Luke loses the knuckle bones cast again. Fourth time this 10 day. We all know how much he hates gut bucket duty. Let's lay up and mock him while he's carrying them out. Here goes nothing. Uh, a stained record that alternates between two different handwritings, one thick and measured, the other slanted and erratic. I did it again, didn't I? Struck keen, didn't I? Pictured it. Helm and cloak in. Partier stumbles to the latrine, bends over the bowl, vomits everywhere. All I need to do is drop a brick from behind, he's done. A most glorious, most keen kill, my friend, but it shudders in comparison to my recent escapade. Poison was the key, and it was on the key. Poor creature reached for the key to lock her homestead, secure himself, and seal her fate. What talking poison are we? My last one was cooking a stew, smelled bloody lush too. Bundy of meat, lamb I think, reckon it was for big celebration, enough to feed a family. Maybe even a whole street. It was missing only one ingredient to my estimation. Had it in his cupboards too, right there. Lie, plenty of lie. Oh, how, the, how they gurgled, my friend. A wonderful chorus. Dropped the fin barb of steel into the soup. She slurped it up. It lodged straight in the back of her gullet, choked to death on soup and blood, found a lonely chef bent over bubbling bath with broth. It was simple, easy. Uh, just pushed the hilt uh, and held his head, felt like barely a moment passed before he did. The elaborate one-upmanship continues in a similar fashion. Yep. One-up each other in murder. That's how it works. But can you one-up each other and who you fuck? Now that's the topic I'm interested in. Is there anything else that's here? To be done? I don't think so. I think that was like the entire area, yeah? There's nothing else here except for that door that we just unlock. Um, I guess so. I guess that's it for this area specifically. No? Oh, well, up there is just nothing. I don't think there's anything here, so let's get out of here. Well, we could just teleport out. Just don't see. I swear there's nothing else here. There's nothing in this room. Oh, wait! No, wait! Is there? Is there a door there? No. Yes? Yes, there is! Hello? 
I just... All I wanted was to have a wonderful, nice day with my vampire boyfriend. I can keep going in this Because hand. you're beautiful. Look at my title, Astarian! But in his doom, he shall spawn a score of mortal progeny. Mmm, grilled pork leg. Mmm, grilled pork belly. Mmm, delicious. Hi, Astarian. No, <laughs> What's over here? <laughs> Hello? Ah! The autosave coming in! That's not a good sign! That's never a good sign! Does Voxer have a middle name? No, Voxer's name is just Voxer Elifiel. That's his, that's his full name. Rats. They swarm when an elder brain is near. We must be close to its hiding place. What? What what do you mean we must be close to the Turn back? We must have all the nether stones before we approach the brain. What do you mean we are near the Excuse me? How do I keep finding shit that I'm not supposed to find? It's up for discussion. Jesus Christ. How does this keep happening to me? Seems like I always accidentally wander into places I shouldn't be in. Chaos will be sown from their passage. Yeah. What's over here? Hmm. Well, you could go down here, but I kind of want to follow the main path for now. Corpses arranged with some intent. Yeah, they're arranged like the fucking weird... Oh, what? Are you fucking kidding me? What is the clown's head doing down here? Wait. I know this head. It belongs to Dribbles, the clown. <laughs> fucking Christ! I guess if we find a few more of these little scenes, we'll have gathered the rest of him. The effigy of em Emma Lisson, who grasped divinity, what used her betrayal? She thought herself perfect but forgot one blows and exaggerated in blood or in the red. Oh, fucking god. Oh, is this where Orin is? Is did we accidentally stumble into finally finding Lazel? He 
did not know. He did not revel in the glory of what is to come. Yeah. It it decided to choose Lazel for the scene. Uh from uh from her. I think she's fine. She can't be dead. Oh, no, uh, Orin killed the kid for me. The kid's dead. She killed the kid as Lazel. Oh, chest. Thanks. Yeah, oh. Milky, did you finish the game? Uh, why? I. Why is everyone faster than me? God damn it. Why am I here so uselessly slow? Thanks for the auto save. But Alondo did not see. He did not know. He did not revel in the glory of what is to come. Well, of course a boss fight is incoming. We have to save Lazelle. We literally have to get the second stone. I think we have to do a boss fight. Hello, oh slash. But Orlando did not see. He did not know. He did not revel in the glory of what is to come. Um, if I do this, do I lock myself out of quests? I assume not. I assume you only lock yourselves out of quests once you have all three stones. The game would tell you again, right? Stone seals this chamber against the world. No key, no handle. Better to forget. Better to live. Oh, please be smart, Voxer. Fuck. All right. You do not discover truth. In these symbols, you see only death. A chill draft strikes as you turn, as if distant eyes were set, watching. Okay, where the fuck is she? What a charmer. Moving it. Here goes. Can we do it? Stones, no key, no handle. Come on, Carlac! Better to forget. Fuck! Better to leave. <laughs> you do not discover truth. In the chilled. Someone there. Okay, you got it to start in. Let's do it. Stone. No key, no handle. Better to forget. Come on! Ah! Oh! My boyfriend. Murder. Bloody murder. Who well, else yeah. but Baal would these symbols honor? 
A chill draft. Forgotten bloodied home. So that, that still doesn't answer how this... How... With haste. Kill me. Huh? Kill me, Astarian. Do it. Do it! <laughs> Hold on, Let's what if we... No mercy. Ah. Alright, let's go. Very well. I guess we don't need to be here yet. We'll figure it out. At least there's a teleporter here. Okay. There's something here. There's definitely something on the other side of this door. A common religious passage often recited as funeral blessing. Lathander to light, saloon to guide, Clevmore to judge, and passage provide. For those who yet live unworthy in guilt, now God's light shall find what hell they have built. Hello, cranium rat. We watch, we wait. Okay. Again, we don't have to be here yet then, which is absolutely fine. Um, but I have... Painted... What the fuck is going on? Wait, sh hello? Why are you still here? Oh, we teleported? This way. Yet yeah, you didn't join us. Okay. There we go. Looking ahead. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Okay, where was that chest? Over here. What do you mean perception failed for everybody? What a day. That's ominous. Let's crack it open. Okay. Where are we? The water looks tainted. Better to avoid it. Um, I mean, it's caustic brine. What do you expect? <laughs> well, you guys can stay there. Oh, hello! Just as I was getting bored, our lord sends us a little diversion. Can I help you? Who are you? Um... Hello? Um... I sent you a post about Astari and I hope you enjoy the tarot Oh, is it the Gerba one? <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> Fucking 
fucking crows. You're gonna move over here. Yeah, it's it's the post of Germa. That's like um, where is it? It's like the uh, absolutely the sword on red wine. Sorry, guys. But it's like it's 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 Germa. Wow, you can just charm a fucking bird. Cool. Alright, so... <sighs> just hit the bird. <laughs> Fuck, don't hit the bird. Never mind. Crows. Okay. And nice. Where are you going? Um, what does this thing do? Oh. Little slump guy. And kill the bird with... Oh my god, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker. On a D&D related note, my recent session saw us fighting against the fan's scuffed game of baseball is in. The runner needed to reach home base while the other team tries to beat them to death. Oh? Uns I fucking hate this! This sucks! Okay, um... Nice. And... Nice, good crit. Okay, uh, you can... Get eviscerated. eviscerated. Here, a star is gonna need it. Ah, 
Ow. Okay, um... One, one is down. The other follows. Nice. This person's almost dead. Ah! Hey, what the fuck?! Come here! Fuck you! Highlights include pitcher throwing a flash bang at me or sorcerer picking up the ball and literally leaving the stadium to guarantee a home run and me getting the announcer killed twice because they forgot to give us hats with our jersey. Uh, I'm glad your D&D sort, like, session went well. Where is he going? Oh, is he going through the door? Hold on, I need to know where he's going. going on up here what is this <laughs> slurry skates sorry I just like looking at a star in it whenever I can Okay, you probably want to open the sluice gate so you can get into the cistern and muck it out. Do that, you need to manipulate the valves to get the water level and heat level to their optimum levels at the same time. Don't get scalded. Alright, me and the boyfriend, we can figure it out somehow. Wait, but we- oh, what? What did we- Still breathing, despite everything. Um... I guess I, I guess I just did it I wait I, there was a fucking there was a puzzle and because Max is stupid and strong he bypassed the fucking thing I hate this this is dumb oh Christ
I can't believe being stupid is working out for us. Yes, here. Okay. Edward Tremby. This dude is literally called Nov Schmaj. What? Are you missing someone? Unstoppable, which is fine. Okay, you don't know what to do. Man, that tadpole really didn't have a lot to eat when it got in his head. Wait, what? Ah, they're shapeshifters. It's just, it's annoying because Voxer's actually really smart. Oh, he made the save. Ah. Oh, Christ. Oh, we can't do anything because of slow fuck Oh my god, he's saving Go. Can't I can't kill the dog. Oh, you're alive. Why? Fuck! You're stupid! Slow! I hate you! Die! 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 Ah. Fucking... Ah. 
I'm so mad. I'm so angry. I'm so mad. Watch it. I'm so mad. No, 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 no. I don't care. Come here. Oh, thank God. Hey there, fucker! Can I interest you in big damage? Haha! -ha. Let's have a little fun. Oh, I guess that doesn't work. Beep, 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 beep. Ah. Critical miss. Awesome. <laughs> Did? Did it? Ju Died on magical surge. Count on me. Oh, we did kill the dog on accident. Ah, fuck. Oh well. Fuck you. All right then. Uh, um, uh, what? Uh, huh? Me. Heading there. This game is weird. Ah. Ow. Uh. Okay, it's fine. We're fine. It's okay. Christ, stupid, stupid, mad. Really, guys? Second draft. All the faces know that you earned Orin's approval. Gaz and man managing the mad Rashimi is an important assignment, but you're letting this whole Jahira impersonation go to your knobbling head. You don't even drop out of it when the Stone Lord is asleep. More of a sim uh, simulated boss or no? There better be a soft bedroll in my near future. You don't have to be openly disrespectful for ordering the rest of us around. Your Harper gig won't last forever, and then you'll be one of the Shalar again. We'd rather be your friends. Best be on my way. Ah. Sorry, little guy. You need throwing build, barbarian. What do you think I am, motherfucker? It was the first perk I grabbed. Really love the useless backseating. Oh. Hold on. Yeah, okay. What is here? Nothing? Am I alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm just like, my brain is like doing a lot. It's like thinking a lot. It's trying to figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Step quick. 
I don't know what I'm doing. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. I I keep finding I shit to do. I have no idea where I am. Traps. How Place is trapped. Where even? Okay, we got a 10. Where are we? Something over there. Click. There's probably some, well, I mean that, that probably opens this door. Yeah, that probably was supposed to open this door. But we, we came in from the other side, so... Well, idiot. Something good here, I hope. I don't like being in sewers. Boxer doesn't belong in sewers. And neither does Astarian. He shouldn't be in sewers anymore. Flowers are so overrated. They're bright, gaudy, and almost never make good poisons. But if we'd only made the effort, if we'd only pushed through. I don't know. Well, so. Each their own, I suppose. Although I am right. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to note that down. A starion does not like flowers. Okay, let's scratch that off of the uh, off of the S uh, S O list. Christ. Yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't like, I guess he doesn't like flowers. We need to think, we need to think of something else to give him. What would a Starion like? <laughs> Maybe a nice garlic dish. Wouldn't that be wonderful? I still need you. Hello, hmm. who are you? A good day to you, sir. I apologize, but Lady Janeth is not currently welcome. You are visit. the most dapper dragonborn I've ever seen. With regards to her recent marriage, you may leave any gifts or warm wishes with me, and I will ensure she receives them. <clears throat> Forgive me. As you can hear, are, are you Lady okay? Janeth is indisposed at present. Please come back another time. Um, indisposed. It sounds like she's being murdered. I assure you, absolutely nothing untoward is happening inside. Lady Janeth wishes for some time alone with her new spouse, and has sent her staff on holiday accordingly. Uh Funny way to spend your holidays still at right, uh, right outside your workplace. In ordinary circumstances, I'd appreciate her generosity more fully. But, well, I prefer to be here for when she changes her mind. Are you sure? Does she often send her entire staff away at such short Ordinarily, notice? Ordinarily, no. Though such generosity would not be out of character. But in this instance, I fear she has other motivations. Motivations I will not talk about. Can I come in? Were you to try and enter, 
There'd be nothing I could do to stop you. After all, I am on holiday. Do as you wish. Oh, okay. Why, hello! What's go? Um. Why are things floating? Um, the candle is having a fucking aneurysm! Um, yep. It's definitely. Is it this candle? May the gods take you first. Yeah. <laughs> Let's turn someone inside out. Okay. On I go. Moving in. What the fuck is of a swine come closer so i can rip out your filthy tongue stop this i love you oscar and i know you love me it's your gold i love hog wife but all the riches oh. in faerun would not be enough to make a life with you worth living oh oh god aid me he does not mean the things he says you help subdue him but be gentle. He's not to blame. Ah, uh, okay. <sighs> All right, let's do this. Need to learn the hard way. I'm not a ghost exorcist. Are you kidding me? Ouch! Did you even hit anything? I don't think so. Now is your last chance to run. Don't be like that, darling. Offer our guests something to drink. Maybe your blood. If you have the courage to stay, help subdue him. But be careful. I could not. I stand don't know where they him. are. Christ. Well, you can see. Oh my god! Hmm. 
We, we must have something that lets us see invisible things, right? I don't... Ha 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 ha. You bitch! Please, this isn't his fault. Help me subdue him. Quiet, woman. I'll scratch out your eyes. Hit nothing. Oh, Christ. Survival is all that matters. I don't know how to proc the sea invisibility, though. It seems like it's just random. Fuckers. Oh! You stupid. Come here! Poor fucker. We just need one more. Get it, they're not rolling for it. Can you feel death's cold grip? Save. <laughs> Immune to prone. Are you kidding me? Now they're over the- I'm getting so annoyed! Ah! Explode! Oh my god! Where is this bitch? Sorry, Boxer, you're gonna have to take the damage. Come on. I'm- I'm getting so mad! This stupid fucking poltergeist! Getting mad. Shall we cut and run? Ignis. Fuck you. Nothing important is ever easy. Damn it, just fucking hit somewhere. I'm getting annoyed. This thing has twenty health. I've ran out of spell slots. 
fuck it. Beam it is. Sorry, Boxer. Oh. Seems you owe compensation for the item you just damaged. I lit. <sighs> you never knew vandalism could prove so costly. Perhaps next time you'll be more careful. Really? Really? After I got rid of your fucking ghost problem, this is what you expect of me? Now, not that I'm ungrateful for your help, but... Wait, your face is familiar to me. Yes, I've seen it before in Oscar's sketches. You're the one who saved him from the Zentarim. <sighs> You're remarkably calm, given your husband just tried to kill you. I'm getting rather used to it, unfortunately. Not long after the wedding, he lost his appetite, fell into dark moods. He started to avoid my company entirely. Artistic temperament, I thought, but it worsened. He became violent, called me some rather imaginative names. I hesitate to say it. Something unnatural has taken hold of him. Oscar has been possessed. Really? You don't say! Yeah, so much is off. He's sniffing his paints. The last time I left this room, the walls started bleeding, and a portrait of my mother tried to bite me. Flying furniture and screaming portraits I could deal with. But to see my husband reduced to such a state... What kind of ghost did you piss off? I can't come within arm's reach without him trying to strangle me. And he calls me such vile things. It hates everyone, but it loathes me. It's not him. I know he would never hurt me. And I promised I would let no harm come to him. As you can see, I've already failed. It's obvious he needs more help than I can give. Please, you saved him once. You must find a way to cure him. <sighs> Oscar's behavior began to change shortly after the wedding. He became withdrawn, working obsessively up in his atelier. I tried to take him some food, but I couldn't cross the threshold. It was as though the house itself didn't want me up there. Whatever this thing is, it doesn't want anyone going up there. I swear, it's in the walls. Watching. Yep. I'm sorry about Tiny us. West, some ghosts. Wait. Well. Ah. <sighs> yeah, she does seem surprisingly chill for being in a murder house. Are you still bugged? Already feeling better. Let's talk. Damn it. Maybe one day they'll fix it. Seems simple enough. Alright, time to sleep. Fucking god. Again, what is with this? Oh God, what is I happening see. now? But the wicked don't. Someone is here to disturb your rest. Get the uh, hells away from me. Huh? What the fuck? Peace, brother. We're here to take you home. Oh Christ. The master needs all seven of us for the ceremony. Come with us and be reborn. We'll live again. Oh. Right. The master needs him. He must attend. Oh, I'm well aware of what the master needs. 
But don't we deserve better? Better? What do you mean, better? After all these centuries of torment, I know what you all want. More than power. More than to walk in the sun. You want to see him dead. The right of profane ascension will be mine. And he won't see a scrap of its glory. I am going to complete the ritual as the Ascendant, and then I am going to kill him! This is your chance. Stand with me. Name me your new master. We will get our revenge. And you will all live again. His liar's smile spells danger. He knows full well that his kin will die in the ritual. If any of the bearers of the scar die before the ritual begins, he will lose his chance to perform the rite himself. He needs them to run willingly to their deaths, thinking they stand a chance against their master. Ah. I should trust him. 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 I'm going to 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 trust him. Enough! Enough talk and enough lies. You were always weak, brother. We don't follow weak. only chance to be free to end centuries of slavery you will not ruin it astorian ah uh. well God, why are they healing? Where do I go from here? Ah, balls. How much damage? I fuck. Does that mean that he can't be bitten either? Uh... 
How did you? Oh no, they're still fine. No choice but to keep going. They're going to. Yeah, they just disappear. Good job. So much for awesome. Peace. Critical miss. Stay focused. Damn it. You've met my family now. Oh, wonderful. Uh He wouldn't throw away centuries of planning on a scrap like this. They were pulled back just in time. He will be furious. <laughs> and he'll be even more furious when I get to that crypt and stop him. For what it's worth, thank you. No matter what happens down there, you helped me stand up against him. <sighs> My soul. My heart and soul is falling apart at the seams. Also, we are stuck in limbo. Ugh. We need to find a way forward. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? <sighs> then I'll see you tonight. <laughs> Let's see what this does. <sighs> Christ. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? No, okay. I dare Kazador to send more lackeys our way. This is our territory. I'll crack anyone who tries to come into my house and hurt my people. Karlak, you're so cute. Genuinely. I love you. Not the kind of excitement I usually enjoy being woken up for. Still, better than not waking up at all. Or waking up as something else entirely. Yeah. Okay. Weird, awkward pause. Is there something you want to talk no. about? No. Okay. Christ, I am so nervous. I'm so nervous for Starion's plotline. Gazador is keen to greet his wayward son once more. With open arms. Or iron shackles. Uh -huh. I worry for him so. The dog is unable to speak through the small. I don't know. Maybe you can tell me. Suspension All of I muddy know is goo. I thought of you when I saw it. Thanks for the muddy goo, my guy.
Those vampire spawn came for a starion, didn't they? Lucky for him that we were here to fight them off. <sighs> vampire spawn. One's proven enough, let alone a horde of them. Yeah, okay. I've had my eye on you. Um, hot as brimstone, jagged as lightning. Stay away from me. And seething like the river Styx. But there's something missing, isn't there? You're hungry for pleasures beyond this plane. Something more satisfying than mortal. <gasps> what? Flesh, Leave me alone! Blood and bone. I have no idea what you're on I'm about. I'm talking of the mundanity of a life ignorant to the thrills of the nine hells. Yes. You're curious. Your eyes are lit like raging stars. You want what only I can give you. The ecstasy of agony. The pain of the damned distilled into pure bliss. Beyond every climax you've known, ha. the little death writ large. Smile, and I'll come to you when you put your head down to rest. I will sate your most forbidden lusts. No, I'm or good. Don't. And know the eternal ache of the unknown and the unanswered. I Why is everybody so horny? What? Leave me alone! Fucking God! Then we'll keep it our little secret. No! Hand to beating heart. The same thrills I offer you. Some experiences are better when shared. I hate this game. I just want to be with my vampire boyfriend. I just want to be with my vampire boyfriend. I am curious to see what the fuck happens. I need to I need to see. Tonight then. Be ready. Uh, what the fuck is she planning? Okay, whatever. We're reloading anyways. <laughs> Fucking god, dude. You are enveloped in myriad <laughs> sensations all at once. Flaming desire and icy despair. The strength of iron and the haze of thick swamp mist. The nine hells of Beartor. The ultimate torment, some souls would say. <laughs> Those souls lack imagination. I'm going to show you the true wages of your sin. Um. Pure lust courses through your veins <laughs> and plucks at your flesh. Please! You don't know what you want, only that you want it. <laughs> you feel it, don't you? Very NSFW Primal warning. God, hunger, get fight. Impressible decadence. All right, I'll I'll tell you guys Forget what happens. The heavens. This is paradise. Oh, it's right on her Let lips. Let me show you. I need to. I, I'm. I. Hey, someone said heavy NSFW warning. So, I'm not taking my chances. 
An inferno engulfs you. Your lust blazes. He's off. naked! He's Do naked! <laughs> she just like Where went on his fucking clothes. March, screaming their rage. Where the sticks collects the blood of the fall. Yeah, his cock is out, Reach dude. Out. Have a taste. The flavor is exquisite as spiced yeah, wine. Balls and all. Terrible as <laughs> His cock is out! It does not quench your lust. It only stokes it. Don't worry, pet. I won't leave till you're fully satisfied. Dis, the blackened Elysium. Minaros, the rotting bog. The molten seas and soil of Thlegathos. What is happening? Stitchia. His cock is gonna get twisted ocean. into a balloon animal! Choose a hell. Have your fill. Hey chat, which one would you choose? The barren wastes of- here, I'll, I'll, I'll let you see this one. <laughs> The barren wastes of this, the polluted swamps of Minerus, the rolling lava of Phlegathos, the icy seas of Stygia. <laughs> two or three. Wait, people are going for two or three. Why is there hair on him? Dude, I don't fucking know what happened. Hold on, I'll do it! <laughs> this is so fucking stupid! <sighs> I see a lot of threes, so threes it is. Magma flows around you and into you and the devil Look, in the you leaf. is awakened. The heat is unbearable, yet somehow not nearly enough. You crave still more. A leaf cart! To think how you starved yourself up to this moment. To think I, how you chose the sweet bullshit. over the bitter. One last choice. And starve no longer. Malbolgia. The desolation. The forgotten ruins of Maladomini. Why is there so much? Dania and its mountains of ice. Or Nessus, the seat of infernal power. Okay, chat, go for it. Choose. Right, you're, you're correct, there's nine hills. I forgot. Four. A lot of people want four. You are flush with untold <laughs> power. You could rip apart <laughs> mountains <laughs> and bring gods to their knees. This is the ultimate you. The commander of the planes. The director of fate. Ah! <laughs> Sorry! You saw every living shit out of me! Oh my god! Her tits. Good on you, Boxer. Step into Mizora's outstretched wings. Okay. Your hunger pulls you toward her. The hunger for the twin heats of Avernus and Phlegathos. Jesus Christ. Mizora's lips meet yours, and Nessus rises. You are locked in torrid struggle, each fighting to conquer the other. There's so much ass on my screen right now. Yes, in a wink, you are reformed. 
a devil in spirit, if not body. For one depraved night, you feast on the sins of the body, the mind, and the soul. Okay. Oh, Christ, what do you want? Pleasure of torment. The torment of pleasure. You're forever marked. Can't you feel it? Where my lips scorched your skin. How your soul burns with flame. Your pores flood with heat and frigid water. Your parched tongue searches for the right response. you'll crave it in spite of yourself a pity for you the one taste is all i'll give well i hope i'm not interrupting excuse me astarian what a pleasant surprise i must have drawn more blood than i intended i think i'll nip out for a bit let you two lovebirds chirp who would i be to meddle in personal affairs Oh my god. No! Oh, oh my god! No, I feel like I just cheated on my boyfriend! This sucks! Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? Um... Uh, uh, well, well, I mean, yeah, I did! It's just... Uh, that's exactly why I don't do it. That's why I don't like- I- that's- no, mm-mm, no. Mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. All of this was awful. I- I hate that I'm just doing it because it, like, sates my curiosity. Ugh. Ugh. I'm save scumming? I'm. Well, I was going to say no. I. Bro, I don't want to play. Thrills I, offer you. I don't want to play another eight, like fucking a hundred hours just so Trust I can me, see the outcome of one answer. Ta ta. Let's talk. If not over. I mean, I already said I didn't want to do it. I only, I only said yes so I can see what happens. Save it for next playthrough? Uh, no, thanks, I'm good. All right. Yeah, I need to. I need to do this. I need to do this or else I feel wrong. I have a lot on my mind. Gods, you're beautiful. Us. I need to do this just so I feel better about myself. If the game gives you a quick save, <laughs> then it's not like save that, scummy. You know? It's using what the game gives you. Christ. My fucking soul feels like it's burning. Oh! Um, I guess not then. Bye. Oh my fucking god, there's so many of them! Uh. 
break this fucking thing. Wait. Oh, we have to bless. Uh, or force? What the fuck is this bullshit? Oh, God. I'm ready. Hey, fuckers! Move curse? I thought I did. Unless I removed it. We have bestow curse. I Christ. Lol. Stupid fucking poltergeist. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Are you kidding? It explodes! Cry about it. Oh, I see. Time for a new approach. Superb. Oh my God, it does nothing. Oh, great. Awesome. Love that. It does nothing. Oh, fucking God. What is this hell? We have Ugh! Here comes a question. Will this work? Fine, I'll save you. Oh, you do need to use that spell. Can't be added to inventory. Um, this is bad. Shadow Heart doesn't know remove curse, which is bad. It's bad. Ouch. 
Oh no! Um. Well, here comes the question. What the shit fuck now? Heading out. Let's spill some blood. Um. Hold on. I'm gonna try something. Where's my axe? Premise. Fuck me, dude. Ugh! I'm like trying to think. Huh. Why can I not? Hey, I'm getting, I'm getting real bad. No, with greater toughness, it doesn't work. Christ! But it's doubled! Okay. 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 One more. We need to. We need to get out of here. We need to flee. What now? Oh my God! It's behind us. Oh my God! Cool. Shall we dance? This way. This is fucking insane, dude. <laughs> Boxer's about to die, I think. Can't give up. Heading there. Oh. What? 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 Ah, damn it. Over there. Oh. Open the fuck. 
fucking door. We can't flee. We are literally fucked. I must heal. I literally it's literally not letting me see it, which is like It keeps managing its saving throws. I, I can't I can't escape! I don't know where the enemy is! Christ. Let's turn someone inside out. Why can't I? I need to get out of here. We're almost out. Bye, boxer. Um, we'll go and pick you up later. This is bye. Are you looking? Bye, boxer. Okay. Shadowheart still has to get out of here. Karlak! <laughs> Jump! You have to! <laughs> you have to get out of there! Can, uh, hold on. These fucking bastards. Okay, um, let's get rid of planner binding for now. Okay. All right, Astarian. We, we, we got this. It's fine. We got this. <laughs> a little bit of a hiccup. Don't worry about it. Foxer's dead! Keep your distance, darling. All right. You can leave camp again. What's next? Area. No time for Danny. Really Alright, you two. Oh, move, move, move. Move, move, move. You got this. Come on. First of all, we can save Voxer really easily. <laughs> Karlak's the only one who kind of needs to suffer right now. It's fine. <laughs> this is really scuffed, okay? It's okay, it's okay, we got this. Here, let's let's help him. Let's let's help him up. Come on. Come here. Take you. I need healing. <laughs> drink your drink your little pots, Voxer. You'll be fine. <laughs> All right, 
Shadow Heart. Your turn. Wits and blades. Let's remove these shot. fucking skulls. I must keep going. All right, sweet. <laughs> okay, Carla. Oh shit! There she is. Get that fucking thing out of here. Soldier, I need your help. <laughs> you good, Carlac? Well, she's kind of stuck. She can't do anything. She's stuck on this balcony. Just like old times. Nice. It's on its way. Okay, that's fine. We got this. You picked the wrong fight, friend. And one more hit. All right, all right, quick, 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 quick. Where's the remove curse button? Ah, oh, we don't have enough movement. Shit! Uh, me up, quick. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's too high. She's stuck. Where is this stupid ghost? Okay. Need to find a way forward. Concentrate. Okay. Remove curse. Okay, here we go. We're doing it, guys. <laughs> I I may scuff my way through things, but that's fine. Vingere, vivere. Fuck you, stupid skull. We can't get Carlac up there. Carlac! Carlac! She needs to jump down here, but she'll die! This fucking ghost is so annoying, I swear to god. It'll be fine. <laughs> oh my god. I hate this fucking ghost. I'm gonna get so mad. Hold on. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Oh sorry, he's gonna get hit. There we go, this should be fine. Will it hit this fucking ghost? Oh! It did hit the ghost. What should I do? Hey, Karlak. Miss this. this is so fucking annoying. Oh my god! Come on, Cleve. Where is Focus. where is the stupid fucking thing? Need everyone alive and fighting. Hey, Carlac, just keep healing over there. Death's cold grip. <laughs> this is so fucking dumb. It's still it's it's making the throws. I'm so mad. I'm so angry. There's still two more skulls. Path is interrupted. <laughs> Fucking shit. Where's the... Okay, there's one skull up here, and then there's one skull right there. 
Can I please see the stupid ghost? I am so mad. This is horrendous. This is the... Where is that? It keeps, it keeps doing a saving throw. I'm going to have an aneurysm. I'm getting so annoyed. Where is this bitch? I'm so angry. You know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? Fine. 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 You want to play this fucking game? Okay. Um... That's Wall of Ice. Okay. Where the fuck you are? I am... I don't know where they are. I missed. I had a choice and I missed. Okay. I'm so mad. I'm so angry. 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 I'm so mad. I'm so angry. They keep. Ugh. What do you mean selective? Oh my god. It is so difficult to do anything. Um. We might have to wait on, uh. I am not mad. There is a singular ghost left. A singular ghost who keeps doing the saving throw! This ghost is on my shit list, dude. The dance macabre. Get oh! Oh! Right there! Right there! Right there! Right there! You bastard! I must heal. No! 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 So damp in the pain. Take you, you. Still breathing, despite everything. I swear to fucking shit. Where is it? Shall we dance? Yeah, yeah. Where the fuck is it? I don't like that it keeps Can't give up. Not now. <sighs> oh 
my god, Fink, fuck! I need a salami. <laughs> I need a salami. <laughs> I need 5,000 salamis. My spell slots. My I'm going to bed. Not again! Please! Okay, thank god. No, nothing. Nothing's going on. Okay, thank god. <sighs> good job guys thumbs up you're doing you're doing good at your side. God, you're beautiful thanks I love you what a nightmare where's Carlac all right Carlac how do we get you well it's fine. We had to get you out there somehow. She'll be fine. There we go. Me? At least she made it back. That's all that matters. I see even more. I see even more. Oh my god. I see all the red dots. Oh my god, I feel like death. This was followed. Something over there. Look at me. Aren't I beautiful? Look at me. Aren't I beautiful? Look at me. Aren't I beautiful? Oh! Hi! How's it, uh, how's it going? No surrender. Blood comes easy these days. Please, Voxer, no. your back. I'll smear your flesh on this cap. Alright. Way to be weird. Oh my god. Okay, I guess we're just going to be stuck fighting these motherfuckers all the time. Let's turn someone inside out. What the fuck is that damage? Die here. You want to. Okay. Die here. You want to. Where is the painting that I picked up? Okay. Die here. More ghosts. To. Let's get rid of all the ghosts, huh? Time to push my luck again. Dude, Astarian does so much. <laughs> Don't. Do not. Do not. Do not. Do not. Do fucking not. Ooh, fun. <laughs> <laughs> 
kill me. Even after everything. Leave him! He is mine! Do we have to get rid of all the fucking ghosts? These guy these ghosts are so an Do not touch him. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's if you fail, you get the ghosts. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay, I love brute forcing my way through shit. For no reason. I am a fucking moron. portrait is ice cold to the touch filling you with a sense of overwhelming dread so why is the woman smiling the portrait is ice cold mm. to the touch filling you with a sense of overwhelming dread so why is the woman smiling this parchment is old, flaky, and smells faintly of tomb musk. Uh, dearest Miss, Mrs. Fervus, I so appreciate this, this, the desperation of your correspondence. Heartbreak can impose such terrible burden. In my humble role as an interlocutor with the spirit realm, I believe I might be able to offer you some reprieve. Bring this letter to my mansion near the seafront, and together we will see if the dead have peace to offer you. Yours in spirit, Miss Sicarian. P.S. The door is regularly stubborn, so you must speak its preferred words. Secrata Mortuorum. P.S. I may even consider this discount rate if you're willing to recommend my service later, Jeff. Okay. Free the artist. Ooh, disguise kit. <coughs> oh, hi! Hey, how's it going? Uh, tormented soul, huh? This is good. They won't know. Ouch. What's that? Then? Is this some new art trend I've not been made aware of? Portrait is ice cold to the touch, filling you with okay. a sense of overwhelming dread. Can I still hit it? Wait, it just—it just keeps happening. Let's have a little fun. All right, Karlak, it's go time. Ready. Um. Where do I go from here? Oh. You don't even get XP from it, so you probably don't need anything from it. I guess it doesn't do anything. Can't slow down. Hmm. I mean, we won't get anything here either. Off we go then. So down we go. What bullshit! What the hell? There's... What the fuck do you mean? Where? How? What? Why? How? Where? Door. Oh my god. Got it. Come on, can't stay idle. Oh my god. What the fuck, dude? At the ready. Oh wait, no. Wait, no, that's a window. You can't get through there. These guys are just not Oh. Door has been opened. Open opened? 
Uh, open to the to... when I go. Quickly. They got aggroed by that pretty fast, no? I fucking hate these ghosts. I fucking hate these ghosts. I, I went the wrong direction. I'm so mad. This area kind of sucks, to be honest. Another fight. Let's go. Can't slow down. On my way. TBH. It's kind of sucky. What is the Phantasm Force? Incoming. What now? These boots have seen everything. I need you so badly. Why are we getting phantasm forced? Ah! Survival is all that matters. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? Fuck is it? It has. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Okay. This thing is dead. Good. Moving. <laughs> yeah, Vox, you're supposed to see invisible things. Enough sitting around. Let's go hurt someone. But the problem is that they, like, can do, like, fucking checks every single time. And they can just, you know, not be revealed. Time to pack it in for the day, I think. Stupid. Bullshit, stupid, dumb. And there's gonna be even more in here. Hi. Hmm. What's that? A quickly scrawled invoice of working completed. Record of work 29 Tarzak. 
Complete installation, sliding door concealed to cubby in atelier. Initial quote, 500 gold. Final invoice, 575 gold. Additional cost, structural reinforcements after door installation, making more secret per client request. Wait, what? What's down here? Four rooms with ghosts. Yippee. A charred love note nearly illegible addressed to Lady Janeth, apparently from a rejected suitor. The name of the sender has been burned away. Okay. Hi, guys. Are you kidding me? Oh my fucking god! I hate these things, I hate these things, I hate these things. Oh my god. <laughs> this is genuinely the worst fucking area ever. use it on people. I can't- I can't do anything! I can't do anything! <sighs> Something got hit. But I don't know... where. Okay. 
Okay. Got to move. Uh, I just I hate that they're like DC is so. Oh, good job, boxer. Moving. We might have to keep everybody close to Shadow Heart. Wait, what? Oh my god! I'm really angry. This actually, like, is the worst. Genuinely the fucking worst. Despite everything. Let's go. Under their noses. That poltergeist is literally on one health. I can't see the- I- This is stupid! I don't know what to do! I don't know what to do! Okay, that one's actually fucking dead, finally. This just seems a little bit too ridiculous for me. Okay, another one dead, but I don't know where the other one is. They can't- I can't even, like, reveal them because they just keep saving throwing. Heading there. This- where is this ghost? Ah, oh, dead. Okay, oh, good, awesome. So much for peace. Don't know where this one is. Lies before me. Incoming. I don't even know where the sky is. This way. Step on my feet. Now this is my happy place. Moving. Nothing important is ever easy. Thank you. Awesome. Thanks for walking into it. Well, I don't, I don't know what, oh, good job, you two. I don't know what else I'm supposed to look for. It's it's something about sliding doors, but
Enjoying the game? Mm-hmm. Yeah? Yes? Dear Lady Janeth, our most profound and gracious thanks for your patronage and granting us the honor... Uh, and granting us the honor of crafting your wedding ring. We wish you the greatest joy for your upcoming uh, nuptials and should you desire in years to come to mark the happy occasion with a gift of similar craft and quality, we would be delighted to offer you our services once more. Along with the returning customer discount, yours in artistry, Omotala. Beneath the signature of the stamp of a shining jewel, the words, the glitter gala and boasting glitter across the letter. I'm feeling like I'm missing something. I wonder. I'm not missing anything, am I? The kitchen? I don't know, I feel like there's... Definitely something I am missing. If I must... Now, not that I'm ungrateful. Wait, your face is familiar to me. He made a point to keep it in... You made quite an impression. His valiant protector. A shame you didn't get here sooner. How mercenary. As you can... Not long... Artistic... Uh. I hesitate to say it. Something... Unnatural. Ah, I listen, I've already... You saved him. Oscar's behavior began to change shortly after the wedding. I tried to take him some food, but I couldn't cross the threshold. It was as though the house itself... Whatever this... Thing is... Shouldn't have wished... Yeah, hold on. Interesting times. I can't talk to her. I genuinely can't talk to her. Is this quest bugged? I literally was up there. What am I getting hit by? I'm shaking my head. What else am I supposed to do? Let's see. I'm so confused. The portrait is ice cold to the touch, filling you with a sense of overwhelming dread. I'm so Why confused. Is the woman smiling. Lose. Let's have a look at myself. Can we lockpick this? Careful, I bite. Christ. Uh. 
A short sword. Okay, hold on. Let me check something. Let's do another rest, no. because fuck, ouch, e, ouch, this entire area sucks! Light on my feet. My fucking bones! rejuvenated i am fine i am happy i'm doing okay let's go look around more let's get out of here first of all i don't want to think about this house right now we are on the other side what the fuck Can we please get out of here without taking damage? Ah! Ah! Oh my god. Shadowheart, can you chill? There's no time to waste. Stupid. Okay. Let's see what I can bring. Wait, no, 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 no. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. What are you looking at? We're allowed breaks. Contract says so. Oh. Oh, this one's corked. What do you mean it's corked? Who corked you? Swift as my feet can carry me. Hmm. I want to go back over here to the entrance. I want to I want to do like a once over. Shadowheart is getting killed by vine booms. Shut up. Okay. Poor sweet fools. You speak as if the plague throne is not already here, striding among us. Say, among you us! Did you read the business? And soon, the cycle will reach. Oh! Do you actually want one? Sorry, um, I can't sell you any right now, but you can look. Mum will be back soon. I mean, um, shopkeeper will be back soon. <laughs> What a cute kid. We serve them now, or there won't be any left. To shut them up. What is going on here? It, it's not what it looks like. I promise. But, yeah? You don't want none of this. Trust me. Okay, but what if I do want some of this? Oh. I could pay half now and half tomorrow. Do okay. Do I look like I was born in a 
Openness. This guard caught you picking a lock. Perhaps you'd like to try the lock of your very own cell. Oops. Ha 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 fuck. By Starian! <laughs> well! Shit. <laughs> ah, fuck it. Let's keep your hand. Quick. Quick, quick. Um, how do we get a Starian out of here? That thing is tiny, and I am not. How the fuck do we get a Starian out of here? Just like that. On the hunt. Let's keep your hand. What do you mean? Time for discretion. Hold on. It is a big He's just gonna walk out. Certainly. Cool. All right, time to leave. <laughs> How about this? I don't think he needs bailing out. He can bail himself out. Quick, quick, go to camp. Go to camp. Go to camp. All right, he can stay there while he waits his bailout. Waits for his bailout. It's fine. Uh, I don't know how it happened. Ooh. If you can't afford it, moving in, stop wasting my time. What do we have here? Hey there. I should speak up. The city is chock-a-block with bodies, thanks to these murders. I can barely keep up with all the orders. I have no idea how I managed to get a Starian out of there, but I think it's hilarious that we did it exactly like that. It's fine. He just... he needs a moment. It's okay. He can figure himself out. I do. But this tombstone is yet to be engraved. the cats i forgot hey oh, i love chopping things up who doesn't uh, okay all right a starian can come out of out of hiding all right there we go hey fellas how's it going don't uh don't mind me i'm just coming through just, just a civilian. I've done nothing bad. I love a Starian can just do what he's doing. Oh, we need to equip his weapons again. There we go. And his bow. I know how to get into that room. Hello, hi. Don't mind me. Just coming through. Candle Hallows tombstones. Remembering the deceased with sympathy and skill. Candle Hallows tombstones. Speak your loss. The self-help book explaining that true happiness begins with the tidy house and well, all right, well, this bitch is about to lockpick. 
Nothing can hold me up. Hello. What are you hiding in your little tombstone? What are you hiding in your little store? Bread? Okay, why are you hiding bread in a casket? Why is... What? A fine selection of tongs. The one indispensable tool of the artisan's workshop, it seems. If you seek the tribunal, let so death be your guide times. for what is behind death but murder. Okay. You're very on the fence of buying this game? Don't be! It's... I've been... It's... How do I explain it? It is... The best 120 hours you'll ever have. <laughs> Dear Clerk Dravage, remember you are in the business of making cattle hallows tombstones look like genuine retail establishment. Keep all the prices about half ag uh, about half again too high so you don't sell very much inventory. Think of the shop as a stage set rather than an actual going concern, the manager. What the fuck? Because it will liquefy your laptop? Oh, that's fucking fair. That is the one concern that I understand. Can't give up now. Moving ahead. Hey there. Quick word. Oi, we got rats in cellar. We also got cats, but cats are useless. So how about you kill the rats? The ra the rats are dead, dude. Good news, chief. I already killed the rats. You did. Very clever. Good job. Yes. Here, you take this. Oh, thanks. Uh, I also have a pro uh, Hey, I have something else to tell you. Hi. You already got paid. No more work here. Plenty of rats elsewhere in the city. Go kill those. Uh, I need to warn you, Chief. Uh, or Chef. Chef. Your name is on a murder target list. Rats. Murderers. Always knew the Chef gig wasn't going to be easy. Do not worry. Chef Revere's eyes will be kept peeled for murdering types. Yeah, are you sure? Okay. Fixy, I guess. Well, we'll see about that. Hopefully you're correct. I know you said poor, but we own Gortash, Archduke of Baldur's Gate. I hear he's moved into the penthouse of Worms Rock. That place must cost a fortune. Per diem. Uh-huh. Archduke. Your excellent. Aye, aye. Pull up a seat. If you can find one spare, that is. Business going well? With all this talk of war, what else are folk to do but drink? I reckon the murder we'd had something to do with it, too. Got punters all intrigued. But on that morbid note, what can I get your fine self? A kiss with my beloved. Ah. Uh... I'll tell you what. The murder upstairs has brought some punters, but it's also really spooked folk out of renting rooms. If we get you staying up there, perhaps folk will calm down and realize there's nothing to worry about. You can have the whole upstairs floor until this killer thing blows over. Why do you hear Gab everywhere? It's because it's his, uh... Uh... <laughs> Charity! In Baldur's Gate! Good one. Sorry. No! For free! Oh my god. Let's see if it works. For free? Come on. You guys are so hospitable. For free. Oh shit. Oh shit, fuck. I was joking! It was a jest! I was just kidding! See? Alright, alright. Calm down, you mad bastard. Top floor's all yours. If it gets a bit too noisy at night, well, 
Don't sleep above a pub. <laughs> See, didn't have to. Perks of the train. Astarians inspired. Oh shit! Carlex inspired. Don't. Simple. A proper logic is finally. Oh my god, we're inspiring everybody. Still breathing. All right, Despite let's uh, let's take the blue wheel, the white bread. Wow, thank you for all of the free items. I'm so glad I don't have to pay for any of this. Now we don't have to worry about it. Cool. Best keep your hands to yourself. Oh shit. Wait, what? Everyone else might step in. What the fuck? Who saw me? What the fuck? Can, Nothing good. can I have that? Please? That has to be a bug, right? Yeah, but. For the taking. I guess the window counts. All right, let's go, uh, let's go upstairs. How do we get upstairs? Oh, there we go. Wait, what? Hold up, citizen. This is a crime scene. No one Grotesque as it is, it's part of the furniture. The elf song wouldn't be the same without it. Ew. Stelmane's parlor. A place to receive clients and friends. I wonder if it's as I remember it. Hello? Oh, bollocks. I told those idiots not to let anyone through. You. Name, rank, and reason for interrupting an active crime scene. For your sake, the last one better be bloody good. Um... Uh, why are you so angry? I'm chasing down a serial killer who seems to kill without motive. Will you try doing that and staying calm? Sorry! Unless you've got useful information, leave me to my work. Duke Stelman's dead, and I've got to find who killed her. Um. God, that's it. Proof that I was right. I've been working on an assignment, see? A research project of sorts. I knew my conclusions were sound, but this, I never expected this. I'll tell you what I know. Okay. A century ago, there was a man, Saravok Anchev. He was a child of the god of murder, Baal. He ruled the Iron Throne, a dark tower hiding a darker secret. It was the front for a deadly arms dealing network. There. Saravok amassed an army, and sought to become a god. Under his stewardship, the Baal Temple was revived. And with it, the Baal cult itself. Fortunately, the temple was destroyed. And to cleanse the city of Saravok's memory, the Iron Throne was torn from its foundations, and cast into the Chiumthar. For most, that was the end of it. But cults like that don't disappear overnight. That list you spoke of confirms I'm right. The Baal cult is back. And someone is out there, continuing Saravok's work. Yeah. Uh, you're not wrong about the cult. I found some Baalists in the sewers. No doubt you found a trail of bodies in their wake. Yeah. The brutality of the killings is on a par with Saravok's own. But there's something more here. Something new. Yeah? There's a reference to these murders. A certain flair. It's as if they were done in worship. 
The precision of the cuts. The depth, the execution. The best butchers in Faerun couldn't make a cut like that. Trust me, I've asked them. Uh -huh. I tried to explain all this to my superiors, but they wouldn't have any of it. They told me to drop it. Told me the city doesn't need another conspiracy theorist and to get back to doing my job before they find someone else to do it for me. But you... You're not bound by such constraints. Oh, help me out here. Help the city out. I bet if you follow the trail of these murders, you will be able to unearth the truth of this resurgence. Ah. Uh. What about the other victims on the list, the ones who are still alive? There are patriarchs on the murder target list. I'm oath-bound to secure them first, so I'll be heading to the upper city next. While I'm there, the other potential victims will be at risk. Could you warn them? Yeah, I can try. Thank you. That's all I can ask, and more than I hoped. Once I'm done with the patriarchs, I'll head to Basilisk Gate. To have another go at convincing my superiors to put some resources into this matter. Meet me there if you've anything more to report. And good luck. Thank you. I need to put on my beautiful outfit again. So does Astarian. There we go. Now we all look really nice again. Okay, we have the upstairs to ourselves. Elf Song Hospital. Forging is a thing of the past in the Elf Song Tavern. To purchase camp supplies for resting, simply visit the dumb waiter hatch. Wait. Wait, so this is like an area for the companions? You can just stay here? Let's talk. Oh, it's like a it's like its own personal We have a bed! We have beds! We can sleep! Cass, you're beautiful. He's... I'm going to suck his dick, I swear to God. We're all bunking together. Soldier. Alright. Add the song. Hey, your wing is in the wall. Where is Holson? Oh, there he is. First in my heart. Oak Father, preserve you. The city, you mean, with all its noise, smoke, stone, and bustle. I would not be here given the choice, but I promised you my support. And that is what you shall have. Yay! Thank you, Halson. Still, though, this place crawls with life. But little of it flourishes. I see refugees unhoused, the destitute unwanted, orphans unloved. Yeah. The city is like a forest with an overgrown canopy. Light and nourishment cannot penetrate to those who need it the most. And still, it draws them in. The safety of numbers. The promise of civilization. The dream of better. All that potential is too often destined to die in the dark and rot in the gutter. I wish... I wish there was a better way. I wish everyone could see the sun, have a full belly, and know nature as a friend. There is a balance that is yet to be found. <laughs> Listen to me, preaching like an initiate in his cups. I think it's such an idea, an archer of your vintage is fine for him. Perhaps you can help find that balance. Yes, I hope so. But we have a battle to win before any of that. Yeah. All right. He's so sweet. Ah, there you are. Love you. I love everybody here. My friends. Here we go. I wonder if this was part of my 
All right, let's see what's going on over here. The map of the city bears a single marker at the location of one murder site where the slain were... Okay. Okay. Blood singed ring. Ah! Bloodied ring. Guess the killer didn't want jewelry. Crime scene note drafted by a Drevla Fountainhead. Deceased Duke Bellin's stalemate. Location private room is at the Epsong Tavern. Suspected blood loss, which was the killing, right hand missing, clean set. Yeah, God. Okay, that's all we needed. Alright, let's leave! Nice! Let's make our way continuously straight. Um, I didn't want to go up there. Uh, it doesn't really matter, does it? Uh. What's that song you're sort of singing? Roses of Elliant. I may work for a hard-hearted rat fucker, but I still keep a song in me heart. Oh. Vincent here is a wastrel and a scapegrace, but he does amuse me. Oh, shit. Well, just here for me, oh, whoops. I agree with well, you. Well, if you left, you must be back again. My, but how I amuse myself. What the fuck? Lean it on a bit. When I think about the poor refugees starving in Rivington, I could just weep. I believe I'll drown my tears in another brandy. Okay, you motherfucker! Hello. Welcome, traveler. Remember, this ain't the blushing mermaid. It's the elf song. So behave yourself. I will, so long as no one messes with me. You want trouble? Take it down to the guild hall, tough buckets. Not here. Okay. I do really want to start something. Oh, that goes to the rented rooms. Ah, uh, never mind, I won't do that. I love talking to people. Tears balls. Just lost the best job I ever had. Easy work in the upper city. But you don't care. And why should you? Sorry I said anything. <laughs> okay, okay, you moody bitch. You good? <sighs> On days like this, I miss the forest. I used to scamper amongst my woodland friends, if you can believe it. Here. Not a squirrel in sight. Yeah, because everybody here probably kicks them. Because they're all fucking crazy. The service here is worse than ever. <laughs> what do you have to do to get a drink around here? Oh, oh man. I don't know. Ask for it. Instead of complaining about it. Okay, what do we have over here? Shush, honey. The more talk is here. Do not stem your cries. Sob, roar, scream. That's curious. Oh? I will leave you for now. But I shall not be far. Oh? Uh -huh. Death's blessings. If any of you remain. Um, alive, so that's progress. Oh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I thought I was done for. Sorry, Lady Luke, bless you. Um. I'm surprised you're still breathing. You and me both. That's what I get for filching a baldy. 
The nutcase made me dig my own grave. Um, Stone Lord, he calls himself. <laughs> More like Stone Shies. <laughs> 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 I've heard of him, he's a new gang boss, right? The very one. And my idiot self didn't realize till it was finger deep in his pockets. Won't be making that mistake again. Look, I ain't got much in the way of thanks, but the stiff below has some fancy doodads. You're welcome to them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, guys, look. Oh, my God. Guys. It's the metal pipes. I love it when a Starian can just do this. With pleasure. Nobody will see it. Nobody can blame him. Welcome to the mortuary. A seemingly endless list of names and cause of death are written in delicate cursive. This details a recent entry. Deceased Duke Bellin Stellman, human female, brown hair, slight build. Cause of death, blood loss, 36 stab wounds. Position of cut suggests liver replacement. Uh, okay. Never a dull moment. At the ready. Um. This jar. It feels like death itself, a sure sign of necromancy. What do you mean, what? A, a, okay. A collection of a mortician's proficiency note on unveiling and mummification. The more recent notes is as follows. I've purchased a rare find from an adventurer who found it in the Undercity. An ancient funerary jar containing internal organs that have been preserved for... I don't know. Centuries, at least. Their mummification technique is unknown to me, and many include a combination of mortuary alchemy and necromantic enchantments. I must find the time to study this in detail, as what I learned could be invaluable in enhancing my own embalming techniques. Okay. Don't hmm. mind if I do. Oh, corpse robes. Uh, oh no 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 no! Hey soldier, hi. The the note. The note. Oh, that's a book. Hold on. Almost got it. Come on, almost got it. Boxer, come on. Fine, take it. Whatever. Take the rags. It doesn't matter. Here. Added some really lily infused oil to boiling wax. The dip bucket neither wilted nor carried the odor of decay. However, the scent was uniform and lacked variety. Add widow's blossom with spring bloom to the wax. A more pleasant scent, but difficult to maintain solution integrity. The use of a poor solution of varnish, but visible effects may be. Hmm. Alright, now get rid of. Now get rid of the fucking cloth, please. Shit. Here, you can have this. Here, you can have this. Uh, you can have this back. Fuck. Here. Drop and drop. I don't want it. And we are leaving. What is in this room? Ooh, garlic. Hey, Astarian. Do you want it? Sorry, I'm being so mean to him for no reason. Seems simple enough. This note is hastily written on parchment that stinks of rotting flesh and lilacs. The sea is sterling, nightly human male, medium build, brown hair, hazel eyes, three and thirty uh, years. 
Cause of death, untreated infection. Widow claims the deceased cut himself with chopping wood, reported symptoms of high fever, nausea, and diarrhea. Placement and angle of wound in right upper thigh corroborates this as does the postulants. Burial widow unable to afford full burial. Old cop refused to make a coffin without payment up front. Will oil and bind the body to slow decomposition. Oh. Ooh. Ugh. They didn't see me come out of that. Leave me alone. Let's have a look. Molding, moldering coffin. Hello. Good morning. More talk. Any luck with the carpenter? I Hi. Not my child. I'm sorry for your loss, but it will be a ten day before I can take your departed. Maybe more. I didn't lose anyone. Any odors before then? Treat the body with jasmine, honeysuckle, whatever you can get. Um. I didn't lose anybody. Okay. Kerwin? Oh, yeah. He's just outside, under the great willow with the drooping branches. It's good of you to come. He hasn't had any visitors in a long time. Um. Okay. I just want to bring my respect. It's important to remember those who have gone before us. I wish there were more like you. Oh, thanks. Who am I looking for? Well, Morba, thank you for the grace and kindness you've shown me. You've gone above and beyond to give Ayana the best send-off you could have. I've enclosed gold for the casket to bring her luck and her favorite teddy bear. She loved that thing. More than me, I used to joke. I pray things... Ah, A kid's dead. Yee. up here hello okay there seems to be nothing here Better be cautious. Mm. except for the fellow you're the adopters of a culture Let's keep your hands sorry i was just reading the book never mind i won't read your book sorry that was foolish of me please forgive me Is there anything in there? Wait! Hmm? Is. Part of challenge. Ah! Oh Christ, where are we now? Ah, oh, God, how do we keep doing this? Brave and loyal Rocky, who saved his master from an ambush. Oh. You. Oh, you're the hound master. Ugh. 
I can't fight a ghost. Come on, can't stay idle. Haya. Why do I keep why do I keep having running with ghosts? Fuck. Um Wait, the dogs are talking. Starian would absolutely grave rob. I can't be mad. As said, so would Boxer. Oops. Okay. going through it, dude. The city deserves better than Enver Gortash and his army of steel puppets. Let the city win, not him. What do we have here? They see that lighting a candle at the Muslim of Gor Gorian's grand star writer of wish. I never was the superstitious sort, but the desperation makes believers of us all. Here's my wish. Please let me survive. I do not wish to be killed by cultists of any kind. I do not wish to be disappeared in the night or to be crushed beneath the steel shoe of an automaton. Everything seems so strange suddenly. Everyone seems so desperate. I'm alone in this world. If I don't look after myself, no one will. Maybe you will be willing to help me. Here lies Lord Gregorian Gorion. First High Constable of Baldur's Gate, the city's protector. Ah. A book of prayers to Kelamore, Judge of the Dead. Someone has annotated with the following. These are a little saccharine in places, but one or two have genuine merit to something more than religious doggerel. Something that actually evokes the complicated feelings of loss and hope for the departed. Their well-being, the eternal preservation in some paradise. This compendium lists and pays special tribute to the citizens of Baldur's Gate who commissioned and paid for the mausoleum and spot honoring Gorion. Gorion was a hero and a sage for exceptional mind and respectable manner, and under a graying exterior he harbored a heart that bloomed kind and good and evergreen. He was in the first one? My bones ache, wounds, long scars, throb as if new. I long for the comfort of my pipe and the warmth of the fire, but I cannot stop. Gods old and new, hear me. Grant me the strength to keep fighting, the courage to carve out a future for my children. Uh, and when I die, the peace that comes with knowing that I will and all that I could. Oh, 
Christ. Well, I don't know who that is. I don't know, uh, all's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Do you guys have any insight for me? Here lies the houndmaster of the Durin Bolds, surrounded by his loyal pack, good boys and girls all. Ah. Then why are there stuffed wolves' heads? You guys are sick in the head. He was the adopted father of the Protec of Baldur's Gate 1. Oh. There he is, Gordos. Oh. He has 42 balls! Fearless Gordis, who would chase any prey and helped bring in our greatest trophies. I'm an asshole for grave robbing. Aww. Cute. Oh, 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 I know I'm grave robbing, but oh, 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 look at the dog collars. A young cave bear, killed and stuffed before its teeth were fully grown. Bam. That fucking sucks. The cute little guys, the cute little dogs. Mighty Branwen, the foe hammer grants you honor in death. See Baldurg, taken by Umberly's rage, recovered by her grace. Something over there. Where? Over where? Why aren't we grave? I'm. Just under. Well, what are we, what are we, what are we seeing here? Hole? Not a chance I'll fit in there. My faith will guide me. H hole? <sighs> Off we go then. Vinny is you for me. Why can't I go in hole? Okay, maybe you protect me. Okay. Tempers are rising. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? That's a friendly looking shadow. Can't afford to stay idle. Ha ha ha. Hey, how's it going? Looking ahead. Have to keep going. How about you turn in this direction? All right. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Hey, ma'am, can you turn around? Someone there. Okay, let's do it like this then. Um. Oh, you can't cast invisibility. Yes, I'm still watching. Death's blessings upon you. I am. Oh! She made it through! Oh God, we're fucking here. I'll take this way. Ah! Oh! Um, quick, quick, go back up. Oh, 
Yippee! Okay, she needs to go all the way back to where we were by the graveyard. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Ow, my fucking... Ugh. That's interesting that that's how you get... In, that there's so many... That there's so many different ways to get in there. Hello, fellas. To think All right. Hi, Shadowheart. Welcome back. My mum's down there. I put a candle in the box with her. She never likes the dark. Oh. Hey, my folks are buried here. I'd love to pay them a visit. Wait. Oh. Here lie Pluck and Carlac Cliffgate. My parents. Hi, Mum. Hi, Dad. Uh, oh. Sorry, I haven't visited. I've been uh, away. But I'm back now, and I brought friends. I miss you so much. But I'm happy and getting up to some really important shit. Maybe you can see for yourselves. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. You're with me. Anyway. Taters. Me too. Didn't realize how nice it'd feel to come say hello. Mum used to say there was no such thing as death. That there was only change. Dad thought that was a load of woo. That gone meant gone, unless you'd struck a deal with one of the gods. Said he had better things to do in life than beg favors off immortals. I'm not sure what I believe. Something to look forward to. Bit morbid, but true all the same. <laughs> oh. Here lies Pluck Cliffgate, beloved husband and father. Oh, I feel very sick now. Very sick and sad. I won't have a word. Keep a lookout. The Mortark don't take kindly to raising the dead. <gasps> but it won't be long, I promise. Um! You're just a child, this is a good well, idea. Well, it's this or cry. Which isn't gonna help my big bro. Now keep watch. Um. Uh. Exorde me, Merkel. Resuscita fratamian. Um. Emote ad me redigo eo. The air crackles with power before fizzing out. The child has power but lacks control. <sighs> You're close, Merkel. I can feel your shadow. Give my brother back, please. Ah. Uh. Hear the scroll might do the trick. Really? I'm gonna try it right now. You're gonna hate it. Oh, oh! That's what you get, kid! You fucking dumbass! Ah! Ah! Hey! You raised every single undead! <laughs> 
Oh my lord. Oh my god. Spiritual weapon. Still on my feet. Uh, let's get rid of the zombie. Yeah. Now let's get rid of the zombie. Yeah. Shit. Stop. <laughs> Wait. Oh, that's so fucked up. How did you miss that? Having a fucking moment, I swear to God. Yeah, we're kind of dealing with a zombie apocalypse now, right? Dead under the sun is alive right now. Look at the fucking initiative. Look at the action economy. Uh. 
Wait, no. I, I could hurt the kid. Yikes. Oh my god! Brother! Oh no, her brother is a fucking skeleton lord! This is by far a really horrible situation that we have found ourselves in. Um... Poison resistant. Nice. This fucking action economy. <laughs> Did we give her the scroll of super revive? What is going on? I wonder if this is worth the cost. Usually it isn't. God, they're all still dead and alive. Oh God. Oh yikes. Oh yikes. Oh yikes. They're all dying. Okay, good. Uh, 
Don't tell Karlak. Don't tell Karlak. Don't tell Karlak what's happening. Okay. I like that the action economy is going down. It's fine. All right. Awesome. Oh, they're still alive. Okay, awesome. <laughs> no! This can't be the end. Wait, did Voxer just yell that? Aww. He cares about his boyfriend. There you go. This can't be the end. Death won't take me. He yet. screams. There's still something left. Oh, there. That zombie. Okay. I ruined it. I ruined everything. Well, that's what happens when you mess with the dead girly. Open up. You kind of get fucked over. That's kind of what happens. Flowers, every color of the rainbow, right here. Yeah, you're just going to ignore that whatever just happens. Yeah. That's fair. Would Sarah like some flowers? I do wonder if brightening up agrees. I bring fresh ones to my husband's every few days. Uh. Of course. Show me your flowers. Hmm, yes, the black oh yeah, yeah, sure. Mm hmm. Yep. Yep. Give me all those. Uh huh. Yep. I'm buying your entire stock, lady. You're welcome. Come back anytime. Brighten up a loved one's paint with a bouquet. Freshly picked. Hello. What's going on here? Let's save. She's like, I'm eating good tonight. We can play chase Yippee. What's inside? Hello. Like to talk. Nothing wrong with looking, is there? Uh, a man can dream. When Shenpai said, impulse control what? And then gave a grieving child with no concept of what an undead is and scroll of mass rains dead. I really felt that. I'm telling you. You gotta, you gotta have, to they have to learn me. eventually. <laughs> oh, hey! Carla. <gasps> You're looking well. Damon! Would be a lot better if you find a way to fix this engine, Damon. I haven't stopped trying, but all roads lead to a dead end. Sorry, I didn't mean... Never mind. Glad you're all right in any case. Nice forge you've got here. Best I've had in years. Mistress of the house lets me operate from here for a fair price. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't happy. Good. Someone should be. Could we see your wares? Certainly. Wow! Awesome! Do you have a better axe? Aww. Legacy of the Masters. Armor enhancement. Gain a bust of attack and damage rolls with weapons. Could be good for Karlak. Bullets of persistence. 
Let you gain freedom of movement and long strider. Ugh. Sword of life stealing. Ooh. You gain proficiency with short sword, long sword, and great sword. And if you gain a plus one to melee attack rolls. Oh, hold on. That would be good for Karlak now. Well, but it's. Mm. But that won't. Karlak won't deal that much damage. I'll come again by later. Shout if you need anything else. Diabolic Forge. <laughs> why is it called that? Hey, Damon, why is it called Diabolic Forge? Okay. Wait, is it a short sword or is it a long sword? What can I do for you? Of course. Wouldn't be alive to hold them. If it weren't for you. Oh, it is a short sword! Spoiling a Starian. I shouldn't be. Damn it. A suggested nod. You think things. How delicious. I just give him everything. He deserves it to be fair. Shouldn't be here. Uh, what's hiding here? I shouldn't be stealing. I need to quickly be right back. I need to use the bathroom. <laughs> I can't stop playing this video game. There's more. Unwanted Master Gauntlets. Attack and str- Athletics. Oh! Just some special armor. There's another room, but we can't see it. Here we go. Yeah. 
All right. I know I saw another. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. What can I do for you? Absolutely. Rare to get your hands on this stuff. Well done keeping it to hand. Wait, what? What am I dealing with? What did I give you? There you are. And be careful who you show that to. You might draw the wrong kind of attention. What do you mean? Hey, Astarian, why are you... The way that he whispers. Uh... Yeah, but what did he hand over? No, I guess. <gasps> cat, 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 cat. I'm in close. Oh, yeah. Remember? Huh? dialect called Mriar. It wants to know if you're its mother. Yes. Oh Christ. Do I have a cat now? Do I have do I have a kitty cat now? Oh I have a cat now! Will it come to me to camp? Oh! <gasps> I saw it disappear. Is it here with me? Please. No! Is it not here? Worst day of my life! Why are Gale and Astarian, Astarian always so close to each other? Hmm? There's something fruity going on between them and I hate it. Why am I not invited? <laughs> I guess it's not here. Homosexual gossip session? Yeah. Where am I sleeping? Um, where is my bed? Oh, over here? Not, not with my... Oh, okay. Guess I'll just be a lonely bitch over here. My bad. Boxer's not even sleeping with his pet by the pillow. <laughs> the fuck, dude? Me, my son. <laughs> it's me, my son. Boring. 
Oh. Okay. Who are we talking to? Cora. I'm feeling a touch boozy, I must say. But you're back to work later, so Hello. Idiot. Nice day for it. How about I read about you in the gazette? Oh there! Yeah. You're that rotten. Why, hello there. We were just about to try some of Master Metzli's delightful wines. Oh, would you care to join us? Oh, they do look ever so tasty. Oh, God. Ah, Mrs. Highbury, I prefer to conduct tastings individually, so I may assess your palate. Call me Cora, Master Metzli. And I'm afraid I must insist on their joining us. Wine's no good without company, after all. Um, Wine scent is almost sickly sweet with an acrid note just on the periphery. Oh, shit. Poison. Get back! This cowardly worm is trying to poison you! No! It was perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect! You have sullied it with knowledge, made it an unclean sacrifice. I will remember your face. And I will peel it from your skull, should you interfere again. Oh! Oh my god! Honestly, unexpected. The dance become ready or Okay. He's paralyzed. Press the wrong button. Tell me, he's gotten away. Yeah. Interesting. I wonder if we'll get free wine again. Interro discard is promising candidate for unholiness, though he is personally crude. His methods of homicide are artistic and even innovative. Just hear from me walk. He set up a deadly wine festival to light his next target, and I, for one, will be observing it closely. Cool. I'm glad that worked out. <sighs> Can you believe it? I thought this would be a civilized event. <laughs> yeah, I fucking hate it when people die. I still can't believe. Why 
would anyone want to kill me? Thank you for saving us. Oh, I got money for it. Awesome. Anything of use? Thanks, guys. I still can't believe. Wait. So does it just stay? Can I not do anything? Huh. Awkward, I guess. Every single time this starts a ding 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 ding. I keep thinking it's going like Ba 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 ba. Thank you for helping Cora. I couldn't do any of this without her. You're welcome. Thank you for saving Cora. Thank you. Thank you. Very well. I still can't believe. I still. Wait, like, um, okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, time to get out of here. It's not a fantasy game unless someone gets brutally murdered. <laughs> Fucking God! Every single time it scares me. Create a fruit? No, but if I do... Bro shouldn't have leave, left his uh, shop unattended. I'll never understand people who don't want to be famous. The more the people like you, the more you can get away with. What? That is not how that works. Borders Gate's never going to be safe with the absolute out there. Why would the Gazette lie to an entire city? Don't look at me like that. I know all about your grottiness, and I don't need none of it myself. The paper says we're safe here, but we're not. We may as well be outside the walls with the absolute. Oh, maybe laying it on a bit. Kind of terrifying that the likes of Lord Gortash can just decide what's true or not. Despicable. Hmm. One day we will, but not yet. Mama Phallus and Hazelnut. The hostel's up that way. You won't find better around here, unless you can pay for it. Hmm. I bet that hostel lady wouldn't make you clean the dishes. Probably would, actually. So but many people anything. would. We just don't care. People hate me. This is Joel's house. No letters, no clerics, no herb sellers, no potion peddlers, and no steel watch. <laughs> Someone has high, uh, has a uh, specific settings. Just not one for violence, that might be you worth a look. Wait, what? What? What is worth a look? What is worth a look? Oh, thank you, Astarian. Well, never mind. What did you see? You can play all you like. Not a word on all I guess you didn't see anything. Right on our no safe. No matter how many steel watches it it probably is inside the house then. How did he look into the other dimension? How did he do that? His perception is so high, it has x-ray vision. <laughs> Critical success.
Cool! Awesome! Good book! Father, I heard about a risk of shortages in the city. I know you're absolutely unforgivable when it comes to shopping for yourself, so I've sent some victu victuals that could see you through a whole season if you pace yourself. Good for me. I love you very much and will be home for a long visit before you know it. God's willing. I'm love, Sulei. Will you tell Cathora I say hello? I've already sent Uli your love a thousand times over. Oh, God damn it. You can play all you like. No time to rest. Every single time I lockpick something. A broken steel watcher. A tag wired to it reads, Unit defective. Return to the steel watch foundry at the West Docks. Hello. God is busy with their patrol and has no time for idle ch Sorry, my bad. God is busy. Okay. Oh my fucking god! Do you know how hard it was to get those cabbages into the city? I swear to fucking god. No, Lord, impossible. I hate you this game. You really are that interesting. My cabbages! Murder target Frank. How do you get in there? Get out of our alley. Go on, before I make you. Don't call me runt. All right, what are you going to... I don't need any attention right now. Yeah, I've got a lot to hide, actually. Don't Fuck you. Ahead. How do we get in there? What are you going to do? There's a, there's a murder target here. <laughs> Hello. It might not be the time. The humble home of Frank Pear Tree. Oh, someone's already... Someone's already dead here. Ah. Rip. The scrap of bloody paper is scrawled in an erratic side of the hand. You've been picking where I shouldn't pear tree, placing a lodling's fire spitting throughout my city. Disgusting. Now leave no blood. There's no art to it at all. Just burnt ash and corpse cinder. I'll walk for your b**** in here as I pen this. It's rather large for me. They never find all the bits of you if I spread them out here properly. Yikes. Well, he's dead. As you brown and adorn the scour parchment, those wishing to face the dreadlord's tribunal and enter the temple of Bob must slay the targets on this list and frame the corpse. Oh yeah, there's, yeah, there's more info. Bro's been murdered already. So, why is there a soul coin in there? The humble home of Frank Pear Tree. Hi. Shouldn't go wandering in dark alleys. Very dangerous hobby. Gets people killed. Yeah, gee, wonder. Hey, you're Farling's friend. She said to let you in. Funny little gnome she is. Always laughing at me, even when I don't joke. Come, I'll let you in. My pleasure. Oh? Friends in low places. Here you go. A oh, I change my mind. A starion is inspired. Well, well. The fabled haunt of Nine Fingers King. Never visited before. I thought you got around. I always steer clear. If guild members started disappearing, people would start asking questions. And Casador. Understandable. Questions. When the answer is invariably the silver haired one ate them. Get the 
The guild hall has one rule. All crime stays in the city streets where it belongs. Break this rule and you die. See anything you like? Let's talk price. See anything of yours? <laughs> Ooh, you rancid bastard. <laughs> See? Mine's fresh. Welcome to the Geldal, Faerun's finest festival. As long as you're not sober. Or able to smell. I won't bloody your spot. Told you. Mm. I know They're all on the same side. Wow, look who it is. Glad to see you in the city. Hope you found plenty of coin in Ketherick's coffers. Ready to do some business? I survived the hells when Elturel fell. Compared to that, slipping out of Moonrise was child's play. Sure is. We work for Fetcher, handling what you might call pre-owned goods. Talk to Sticky. He'll cut you a deal. Don't bug me. I'm making plans. Big plans, see? I don't know if she made the deal with the devil. I am nervous. Fetcher isn't himself, so I'm running the shop. You buying or selling? Uh... Maybe a bit of both. Oh my god! Hey, don't talk about it, okay, chat? Sometimes stuff we sell comes back around to us again. Okay, so Starion had this one. Yeah, we haven't been using disengage at all, but it looked nice. But now. Now we have a nice cloak for Starion to wear. Here you go. Oh, we can't see it. Oh, it's just normal and purple. Back into your pretty outfit you go. Right. Which crew are you with? Bellbreakers? The children of Hall? The names ring familiar. Two of the many crews that make up the guild. A loose collective with ties to every criminal enterprise in the city's underworld. Uh, consider me an independent operator. In between scores, then. Oh, there's no shame in that. This Stone Lord business has even the bigger crews shutting up shop for a while. Fair warning. The Guildmaster wants no... Fraternizing with the Zentarim. They're here to work, not share war stories. They won't be much use to us if they're drinking and dicing when the Stone Lord kicks the door down. Uh. I think I've ever seen the guild and the Zentarim working you won't. together. The Black Network is working for us. The guild is hardly a soft target, but we're not set up for the turf war the Stone Lord set on fighting. He came out of nowhere and ate up half our turf in a ten day. So if you're speaking to the Guildmaster, maybe step soft around the topic. Hmm? God, there's so much to do. If it's I'm. Look, Ty, you're after. He's in with the Guildmaster. Not even Nine Fingers Keen can escape the great balancing of Guild Books. There's so much to do. It's like actually insane. A charm, of course. And then you'll do it yourself. No distractions, mate. Nine Fingers has me watching over Pierre Priss here. Once our friends in Parliament close, 
with this new duke making moves. Yeah, it's like there's genuinely so much. <laughs> you did not see me. A peer of the parliament openly walking the guild hall would sell a few copies of Boulder's Mouth, I expect. Christ. Bare hands. What? <laughs> okay. Hi there. How's it, uh, how's it going? What? Lady AQ still playing that game? I don't have one ready. Someone's vintage Moonshay Zinfandel collection. But it looks like a lot of the bottles have gone missing. Notes from Himberloo, a street beggar employed by the Guild of Spy on activity at Devil's Fia Antiques Shop. The report concludes with the following. Though the majority of my reports concern the visits of well-known patriarchs to Hellsic establishment, Mr. Katsu might be blackmailed to keep such a visit secret. There was another visitation that I feel should not be overlooked. The Arms Dealer Gortash, along with a known ballast leader, met yesterday with Hellsic for a considerable period. Upon leaving the shop, I heard Gortash the remark, What did I tell you? If Hellsic can get us into the House of Hope, she can get us into Mephister Mephist too. Here follows the report in the inroads upstart smuggler Enver Garta. Oh god. Oh, there's so much to read. The Stone Lord plans to rob the counting house, and Nine Fingers means to trap him there. There's so many fucking things. Holy shit! Before you ask, I ain't got none of that plum prosecco. Now, what can I get you, newcomer? A drink, bartender. A drunken cloth. Oh, nah, I'm good. Thanks, though. The hookah. Hello, snap bone. Your eyes are going to want to wander all over this gold. It's only natural. Just make sure it stops at your eyes. Hi. Huh? Sure, I'll try. I'm sorry, sweetie pie. I don't do requests. But toss me a few coppers, and I'll shoot you a saucy wink across the bar. <sighs> Okay. Very kind of you, sir. I'll be dedicating the next keening elven ballad to you. You look like the type to enjoy one. Let's go. You won't find much fun here today. Guildmasters batten down the hatches till the Stone Lord problem's dealt with. God! Oh my god! Every single time I see Shadowheart, I, her ass is so prevalent. Like, go for it, girl. You're serving real hard. Like, look at that cake! Jesus Lord, lady. Her name is Mango. Guildhall is not what it was. No gambling, no blood games, not even a pissy little peacock fight. Bored. Okay. I can punch you if that's what you're into. Do you hear the Harpers were half wiped out? We should be sticking the last of their bleeding hearts instead of guarding this place. Oh. Uniform's a bit patchy, I know. I was Flaming Fist. But the writing's on the wall there. The Steel Watch will be snatching up our contracts in no time. Hmm. There's so much flavor text in this entire world. The Guild's no army, however tough they act. Just 20 different thieving crews come to hide behind Nine Fingers' skirts. Sorry. Nope. No, got nothing to hide. Just checking. 
Look now, the Guildmaster's little hunt is bringing all sorts of new faces out of the woodwork. Yep, hi, me. I've been put out of the woodwork. Don't bother scoping out the back tunnels. Whole place has gone dark until all this drama is over with. Hmm. No offense, mate, but I keep to your own crew. This Stone Lord's got everyone feeling a mite unsociable. Okay. Well, a lot of people here are floating for some reason. Hello. I need a quick word. Bit of a letdown, this place. Yeah, I agree. Trying to look around and see what there is. Oh well. Time to get out of here. Except that you can go here. Oh well. Not my problem. Here goes nothing. Dude, I don't fucking know what's going on with Germany. It's so human. It actually sucks. God, this is boring. Why is there just a bunch of trash here? A delightfully secluded alley. I would have been in my element here once. But you consort with a better class of people now, right? A different class of person. And a different type of consorting. Let's just stop this conversation right here. <laughs> Looks just like a holy fan, that does. You're supposed to be looking out for us. Not bloody <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm okay. Yeah, he's he's consorting all right. Ah, tee -hee -hee -hee. spattered with rust, you can just make out the words Tina Turkey's Good Time Bazaar. <laughs> Property in constant use. Gathering strictly prohibited. Well? Well, hello. Time to open this door with my lockpicking skills. A starian would probably just like scream out like, I'm, I'm fucking, I'm fucking our group leader. I'm fucking him. I, I'm, I'm fucking him. Hmm. What's that? I have had it! Snowstorms inside the house, blood weeping from the windows, and now Mr. Wimbley's cat is vomiting up frogs! The poor man had a bloody heart attack from the frog! I know you lot are trying to fight back against hags or whatever, and that's great, honestly, but I can't risk the neighborhood just because you were stupid enough to piss off a hag! Keep your end. I want you all out by tomorrow. Oh, great. The hag, huh? We found out the people who lived in Baron's Coop drew the wrath of a hag and were kicked out of by their landlord. A seemingly random collection of book titles, ingredients, and combinations. Pure speculation is by the title of Power of Words Surviving the Fae by Annabelle Lighthammer. Oh god. The anti-hag support group. Yeah. They have so barely legible letter. Dear Mrs. Andriel, Cled found a place. A nice old man called Mr. Gowell used to live here, but his neighborhood said he doesn't live here anymore. Cled thinks it's perfect. We can hide from the hag or fight or whatever you think is, is a good idea. Cled knows you will have a good plan. Cled will wait at Old Gallows for you. Bye, Cled. Okay. Onion, potato, garlic, a burlap sack. Okay, well.
Hello, friends and fellas and everything else. Oh my god, a teleporter. Hello, everybody. Okay. Let's do that, please. What the fuck? <laughs> um. Hello? What the fuck? I. I got lost. And then, when I found Mummy and Daddy again, they wouldn't get up. I shouldn't have run away. Oh. I'm so sorry. Oh, damn. Sorry, kid. Oh, poor kid found his parents like this. It's a tragedy, yeah. But it's not like we can look after him. No, <laughs> okay. Little alone found his forks gutted. Didn't see it happen more, thank the gods. City's home to some proper sick bastards. Yeah, and yet you don't want to. We need to change out his barrel, see? Oh, God. Can't get involved with this. Don't listen to him, kid. You've I got just... to press ahead. Can you tell us what happened. Okay. What is here? Find the night song. Can't afford a failure on a critical pipe. Um, I just want to make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, we want to probably go and get Gale for the Wizard of Waterdeep. I should probably walk around a little bit and see what's going on. Clank. Who the fuck is this? Wait. Don't spend your I fucking know you. I'll bring Laroakin out here, you tin tube. You tell Laroakin I went for his goddamn night song, and now he has to pay up. What are you looking at? Well, Shit, it's you. You went looking for the night song after me. Please tell me you found it. Oh yeah, we sure fucking did. And Asima. Hells, if I'd known, I'd have asked for more gold. Kidnapping costs more than theft. Don't forget, I'm the one who gave you that contract. I want my cut. Ha! You're not getting shit! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Oh, come on! A 14?! Thankfully, we have like five billion inspirations. Uh, thank God we have like five billion inspirations. There you go. I ought to knock some sense into you. But you know what? I'm too goddamn tired. If she's out there, I'm gonna find her. You mark my words. Yeah, you can start with my camp and then we kill you. Get fucked. Welcome, dear patron, to Sorceress Sundries. I am an unperson in service of the revered wizard Laroakan, proprietor of this fine establishment. To browse our wares, say trade. To provide information about the night song, say night song. If you are a city official here to collect dues, <laughs> say taxes. For all other inquiries, say other. <laughs> you are not Mr. Marvin Hunt, the collections officer assigned to this establishment. <laughs> Shit. 
shit. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. False. Please do not attempt to lie to Master Laroican's projection. Damn it. How else can I help you today? Ah, Trey. Enjoy our unmatched selection. What do you have? What an awesome hat. The birthright. Uh, armor. Best of soul rejuvenation. Well, it's unarmed strike. Can't jump to cost an action, cost a bonus action instead. <gasps> ah, shit. One's per short rest. Yeah, I don't. I don't care too much. All right. Welcome back. To the provision of information that leads to the retrieval of the Night Song is worth a great deal to Master Laroican. Do you have information regarding the Night Song? Uh, yes. Please proceed upstairs for further instructions. Thank you. Please come again soon and have a magical day. All right, hold on. Let's go into camp. Uh, hey. I wasn't expecting it. If you're sure, fine. All right, where is Gale? Gale, Gale, Gale. Can you stop hogging my boyfriend, please, for two seconds? I need him, unfortunately. You guys What's can start mulling mind? about later Wait. on. Look, a bookseller. She can point us to the tome I need. All right, first of all, I gotta level you up. Nice! You can learn Arcane Gate. Create undead. Disintegrate! The freezing sphere. Yes, let's disintegrate some fuckers. Dude, I'm scared of Gale. There's not much left. Looks like folks heard the absolute was on the march and bought everything that wasn't nailed down. Okay. Well, no, I did not voice what I'm doing. Welcome back to Sorceress Sundries. How can I help you? To learn more about the search for the Night Song, say Night Song. To learn more about Master Laroican, say Laroican. To learn more about my good self, say projection. Ah, uh, I'm leaving. Jesus Christ. Look around you. Water Elemental appears to turn towards you, showering everything with a bracing mist. Can you clean me? No? Okay. That's why we need the ointment. The lava elemental looks at you placidly, near unfathomable heat beating against your face. Have you seen how much the prices have risen? Might as well be throwing my gold straight into the lava elemental. Why is this staring and smoking? Uh, he unfortunately picked up a bad habit. I'm trying to get him to stop. You're a fellow bargain hunter, I see. The hidden gems here are far better value than the rare books Tolna keeps locked behind the desk. <laughs> He's hot. Oh, 
Oh, Annie, I simply must have it. Welcome, dear patron, to the floor at the top of the stairs. Um. If you have information about the night song, great riches await. If you are here to waste the great wizard Laroican's time, reconsider. Um. Let your knowledge determine your path forward. Don't trust this. What the fuck? I have to put my hands on everything. The night song is an immortal being, the child of a deity. The night song is a priceless ruby from a realm beyond our own. The night song is an ancient potion that allows its drinker to become irresistibly attractive to man and okay. God alike. The Night Song is a druidic staff that allows its bearer command over an army of ancient beasts. Hello. Oh, Christ! Oh, Christ! Uh, 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 uh. Hold very still, Nicola. Uh... Craig's aim is much improved, but uh, still leaves something up to chance. Yes, sir. All right, Crank. Ready? Aim. Oh. Hmm. We have a visitor. That is, McClaw. You may go. Ah. Hi, don't mind the blood. <laughs> I see no night song. Surely you wouldn't have entered my tower without the night song in hand, hmm? Surely my worthless apprentice wouldn't have allowed you to waste my time. Hmm. What do you want with her? Huh. Fascinating. You've been to Shah's temple, haven't you? To the shadow fell. Unfortunately, you speak as though you've seen the night song yourself. Alas, I've paid for a good deal of very privileged information. Now I await the results of the generous contract I've commissioned. Answer now, or see what happens when fools misuse my valuable time. Yeah, your valuable time, motherfucker. Horny, 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 horny. Why do you want her so badly? I'm growing tired of this repartee, my friend. Let us cut to the chase. Beautiful, isn't it? Worth more than your life, too. Uh -huh. I from a Kalashite warlock. There's very little of his soul left to him. Ooh. It can bind a celestial to the wearer's service with a snap of the fingers. And this... This can keep her in place. Forever. Oh, ooh, I don't like her. Uh, I don't like this. Let me guess, I kept the crumb before you wish to become immortal. It didn't work out for poor Kethrick, did it? He was a fool. A desperate mercenary who hoard out his soul to whichever god flattered him. <laughs> I serve no god, but that which stares back at me in the mirror. The night song will be put to a grand purpose, equalizing man and god. Whoever helps me attain that which I seek will be greatly rewarded. You deserve death. Are 
I intend to achieve greatness. And I intend to do it for a long, long, long time. He would seek the power of gods for the pettiest of reasons, his own gratification. At least I seek them for the better of all. Uh, what's that? I didn't quite catch the words, but the insolent tone was clear enough. Uh, ah. Pitying, not insolent. You chase one power without knowing an even greater one lies within my reach. The crown of Carsus. Once we acquire it, your ambitions will be dwarfed. I'll be able oh, to stand Gail. against Mistra and wrest her powers from her for the betterment of all. The crown of Carsus. Nonsense. Even if it still existed, you couldn't possibly handle its power. <laughs> Perhaps you could not. But Netheril's power is in my blood. And Mistra? I know her in ways that most mortals can only dream of. Ah. So it is you. Oh, God. Mistra's discarded lapdog. And now you think your bark is cause to make me tremble? There is no need for me to bark. My actions will speak for themselves. In time. Then go. Axe. I'll open a fine vintage in your name. Once word of your failure reaches me. God! That's a 15. Ah, shit! Come on, one more attempt. We have, we have like, I think one more attempt? Two more. That's the fifth ten. Come on, boxer. Your deception is good. Come on, you got this. Yes. Dead. That cannot be. She, it, is immortal. A god. She was a Selunite held by Sharon. So death was inevitable. Is that meant to be some consolation? She, it, was the key to my immortality. How can this be? How can this be? Shit! Oh. Ah! He's such a piss baby! He's so mad! Boo hoo 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 hoo! Oh. The poor little guy is so fucking white. Ah! Oh, I want to kill him so badly. Oh my lord! Oh my god! Ho! Oh. Ho ho! No, let's go, uh... Oh, I want to kill him so bad, but I don't think I'm strong enough. There's so many things here. It's up for discussion. Your terrible tidings have cost me everything! My grand design! Dash the ruins! Good. This always happens to me! Yeah. Oh, boo, 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 boo. Oh, boo, 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 boo. I love it. He's such a fucking piss baby. They really do deserve nothing, hmm. Well, who cares? I'll be back. I'll kill him, eventually. All with time. But Are we talking to this person here? Literature department. Can I help you? 
Uh, I'm trying to find out about part of a uh, particular another East Crown. Psst. These books are sensitive. They prefer an environment of quiet reverence. Uh. Is that true? Books are you sensitive? Ah, <laughs> ah, for the least bit of respect for the written word. Sorry, my bad. Go act the clown on your own time. Come back when you've cobbled together some manners and are prepared to pay for the damages. That's better. How can I help you? Scrolls. Parchments, codices, tomes. Take a look and see what calls you. I want to scream at the books again. Enchantment, magic illusion, hags. Which book am I supposed to grab for Gale? Or is this the one? Hmm. This is hardly the time for idle banter. The annals of Carsus are here. Waiting to be read. Um, okay, Carsus. How can I help you? <sighs> huh. Bold. You might have heard that our library has a collection other shops would lack the skill to curate. Between us, even Master Leverokin was reluctant to house them in his tower. Pen is mightier than the magic wand, apparently. <laughs> They're locked away here for their and our customers' safety. Our finest reserve includes the Tharkia Codex, the Annals of Carsis and Netherese's Folly, Sites of the Sea, and the Curriculum of Strategy. Do any of those interest you? Carsis, yeah. It is said to be written by Lord Carsus himself, the Netherese Arcanist who attempted to replace the goddess Mistra, failed, and was banished for the attempt. Great magical knowledge lies within those pages, but not many can withstand it. That's it. That's what I need. The annals of Carsus would no doubt have much to say about the crown's true nature. If only you could read them. Bye. Books as temperamental as these are not on sale. They are secured in our vault, where none can harm them, nor can they do any harm. Consider yourself lucky to have learned of such a book's existence. And then forget about it. The annals of Carsus are best left unread. Shit. Fuck. Oh my god! Yes. 
Listen. Imagine if a tome so dangerous was sold to someone with such poor comprehension. <laughs> you certainly have. Even simple knowledge of these tomes is enough to stimulate most. How can I help you? How are you feeling, Bug Still Sensitive? Nah, I'm good. Not yet! Away with you then. Immediately. This is hardly the time for idle banter. And everywhere else, really. Well, we need to figure out where she is, uh... Where she's keeping them books, am I right? Another teleporter. Nice. I want to look around a little bit, see what I can find. Oh, this is pretty. What? What is this? The Bloom Ridge Park. Ooh, we're really close to Cazador's place. Should we head there? Hey, dude. What the what the fuck are you doing? I fuck. Hey there. Can I help you? I won't give in. Uh, I forgot to... I forgot to get rid of Gale! Whoops! Oh well. Oh, there's so many evil people. Oh, he's invisible. Oh! Oh shit! How's it going? Um... Lightning bolts. Where is this integrate? I don't think I have it, do I? It's not, it's currently not. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't prepared it. Anyways. <laughs> Do I just hit them? No, that's... <laughs> no, bad idea. Bad idea! <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Fuck. Oh! 
You don't hit allies? Oh, I didn't know that. Hey, are these guys gonna join the... Keep out of this, Captain. Do not forget whom you serve. Hello? Of course, I just thought you might need assistance. I... You feel an all too familiar squirm in the recesses of your mind. The fist has a tadpole, but something's off. Not I. We. And we do not serve. Defective. Very well. Another offering to Baal. What the fuck? Hello? Oh. Okay. Oh, we leveled up too. Let's go. Oh God. This girl's gonna die. Um. And. Nice. Let's go. Please, Miss Trump. Every time I see that, it's like, mm, mm. wait. Oh, oh, Fine, get three. <gasps> it's okay. And now we hit. Well, well. Look what we have here. And one more hit. Nice. Blood comes easy these days. All right, boxer, you too. Come on. That won't hurt too much. And hit. And another hit. Nice. Oh shit, we're not close enough. Right there, I didn't even see. Oh, they're they're killing innocents. Oh wow, damn! I don't mean it. I don't actually hate Gale. I just think he's the shit he says is lame, but like in an endearing way. Now, ah, uh, 
Um, okay. Entering her mind is like stepping aboard a sinking ship. The architecture of her consciousness buckles and collapses. Oh, fucking Christ. Thoughts yield to a flood of overwhelming power. The Elder Brain. Do not waste time. This mind cannot bear us. It turns to liquid. Listen. Just listen. We learn. We grow. Loosen our clumsy bindings. Aid us. Necromancer dead. Changeling and tyrant remain at odds. Kill them. Oh. You have a place in my grand design. Made into a mouthpiece by the elder brain itself. The merest taste of its manipulations, I fear. So now what? the elder brain's talking what to happened? us. I taste copper. Oh. Best be on my way. No! Bloody hells! Who were that lot? And the captain! She's dead! Yeah, I guess her brain wouldn't survive being, like, taken over by the elder brain. That's fucked, dude. Christ. Barbarian level 12. Let's go. Class feature. Oh, what do we want to do? What is a good addition to our barbarian? What would be good? <laughs> Greater weapon master. Let's go. Let's go. Historian. Uh, what would be good for a Starian? I think I already have Lucky. Yeah, I have Lucky. We can turn him into a performer. <laughs> yes, funny little Astarian playing his funny little lute. That would be such a waste. Perform for me, gay boy. Mm. Is Dex at 20 really good?
Okay. Yes, Carlac! Yes! We should probably also put Carlac up with uh, strength. So like this. This seems good, right? Strength 18, dex 14. Dex or constitution 16. Maybe con. Yeah. Strength and con. There you go. Gale, I'm not using you. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll, have to, I'll have to ask you to go. It's not you. It's me. I miss Just my wife. Me. Go ahead. Uh, I question. I'll be here. I wasn't expecting, all right. Let's go! Wife! All right, let's see. Cleric. What would be good? For cleric. So, like this? Yeah. It's all coming together. Nice. Okay! Yep, we're max level. That's it? That's it. We're max level. Huh. There's something going on here. I don't like it. Careful. I smell an ambush. Hey, Carlac? Are you sure it's not the flowers you're smelling? You may be allergic. But better safe than sorry, I suppose. Guys, literally already happened. Alderan, the city's founder, gazes out to sea. Yeah, do you wonder where he is? Wonder what he's fucking doing right now. Citizen, prepare to be scanned. A rumor to it. Oh, this is a like a like a like a like a restaurant. Save Vanra. Right, the blushing mermaid. Oh, what did you guys find? Just on a few. Oh, <laughs> Fox here, yeah. Connor's big and open view. Nice. Breathe deep and move. Wow, look at all these cabbages that are laying around. I just want to have a look around where things are. Ooh, what the fuck? I wanna fi- I wanna f- I wanna f- like... WHOA! What the shit fuck?! What the- Incredible. What the fuck?! Why did that house just explode?! Oh my god, no! Ah, uh, and the 
heart-stopping bloodsucker. I hope you've changed your mind. No. My neck is yours anytime. Go away. Go away. And I will keep refusing until the end of time. I'm done bowing to the whims of others. Never say never. Forgive the mess. Your blood is far more volatile than I'd anticipated. Sorry? Oh, that's so... That's so cute. Ah. I'll be all right. Let's just get this over with. Nervous to see me again, is he? How sweet. But we have quite a bit to discuss. What a wonder you came to my door just when you did. Did, you did see, the excel it's your blood that Hi, caused Shen the conflagration you just Hi. witnessed. Imagine. What did my it's blood a do? Through in the sanguine art. The likes of which the world has never seen. The Grand Matriarch will have no choice but to restore House of Blodra after I present her with my research. Uh. But listen to me, rabbiting on about myself when I have you, the prize bleeder, on my very doorstep. If you'd come inside, we could discuss something far more exciting than drow politics. Um. I'm curious about what she has to say, but I really like the... The gay answer so cute. How I made him feel. What I propose goes well beyond such frivolities. We are talking about alchemical breakthroughs based on the blood that runs through your veins, my friend. I appreciate the thought, truly. But if this is something you want to look into, well, hearing her out won't kill us. Are you sure? And if it does? Well, death never stopped me before. I don't know why it should now. Okay. Now, now, I do think that's enough. When you see what I've been working on, bygones will all be bygones. I assure you. Okay. Let's let's have a yes, look, I guess. But did the house have to explode like that? That scared the living shit out of me. <laughs> What's that? Again. Your thievery has been noticed. Whoops. Choose your next move Oops. carefully. Oopsie. They didn't see it. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> uh oh. Your words have only made you appear more guilty. The guards. Shit. Shit. Being arrested for theft. Fuck. If you have a defense, make it now. <laughs> Fuck. Oops. <sighs> Shit. Good thing I shave as often as I do. Christ. I do love how cute the answers are that you can do based on Astarian. Forgive the mess. Oh, uh, yeah, hold on. Yeah, let's get if through this. Come inside. Well, hearing her out when. Okay, let's go. On my way. This time I won't touch anything. 
That's curious. Hello. So, what's the point? Ah, a cozy little spot, isn't it? These four walls have witnessed greater alchemical triumphs than the keep of Erngath Durand. And now that you're here, the crown jewel of my research is soon to be faceted. All you have to do is drink Formula Gruner. The fuck do you mean? If that's her formula I can smell, it's even fouler than her blood. Oof. Cuts below. <laughs> Ah, uh, Formula Gruna. Yes, Formulae Arku through Fruag were spectacular failures. But Gruna, Gruna is different. Believe me. Believe you about what? Ah, oh, God. What will this formula do? When you first entered this home, you saw the incredible latent power within you huh? exposed in all its nuances. Formula Gruner will unleash that power within you. I will explode? Risky, but, um, safe. Say no. The only thing she's offering is pain. And I, I, I don't want to see you hurt. little stutter like he wasn't sure if he wanted to say it <laughs> not even for the betterment of the alchemical arts the realm over not even for that i am curious to see what happens so i'm auto saving i would usually say no oh marvelous i've never been so excited for anything in all my days just Stand over there, far over there, and drink up. Um, what are you doing? That had better go down the drain and not down your gullet. Ah, uh, he's so protective of me. <laughs> All right, time to explode. Um. Mmm, delicious. Am I explosive? Oh. <laughs> you might want to wash up first. Your vandalism has been spotted. You told me. The explanation is in order. You managed to calm the situation down. Oh my, my heavens, you lived! This is incredible! I'm seeing stars! How do you expect me to I die? I hypothesized you wouldn't, my friend. And you've proven me absolutely correct. I don't know what to say here. You <gasps> Love your content. first detonative exsanguinator. To put it simply, from this day on, your blood goes boom. Big boom. <laughs> it's incredible. All it needs is a spark. We just explode now? <laughs> is this going to kill Certainly me? Certainly not. But it might do damage to anyone who makes you bleed without your express permission. Uh, I assure you, the pleasure is entirely, entirely mine. This hello, hello, 26 months. Thank you so much for the 10,000 like biddies, by the way. Jesus Christ. Indeed, 
It could protect my line for generations. Now, let me offer you a little treat. In exchange for the teensiest vial of your marvelous blood, I'll give you something that'll really throw your enemies for a loop. I'll only ask a nominal fee in exchange. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. You really are a fine collaborator. I need to know. I need to. Until next time. Uh, sorry, you're in the wall. Night Song will be pleased to know Larokin isn't after her hide anymore. Although, she may be even more pleased to know who put that bounty on her head in the first place. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. I love him. Good for what ails you. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? Can you still. Then I'll see you tonight. Oh, so he can. You sweet gem. Okay. So we're just explosive now. Okay. <laughs> Imagine the Starion just explodes while drinking. I want to go to Cazador's place now. Right here. We need to go over here. Oh, it's so bright! I still can't believe that place just fucking exploded. Jesus Christ! I don't know, I think Voxer being explosive is kind of funny, and... Wait, how do we get... Oh, we have to go this way, okay. Just three times, only have to say it, three difference does it make. Hello. What is this? Is this it? The devil's feet. I, I get it. Is there something you want to talk no. about, my? Hello. Because... Oh. Hello. I welcome thee to the Devil's Fee, where every hellish curio's a rarity. So merry be, and shop with glee. Oh no. Definitely something up with this <laughs> Trust me. Okay, I trust you. You must be awfully familiar with our esteemed Archduke to know about a thing like that. I happen to bond some of his cor pen correspondence that mentioned your dealings with him. We were lovers. Ugh. Truly. That's remarkable. I like to deal with remarkable people. Very well. You seek answers. Lord Mammon seeks coin. I will happily mediate. Make me an offer. Mammon. I knew it. I did. <laughs> Coin will do your corpse no good. Speak! You want answers, you pay. Just like everyone else. 
Damn it. Mammon is nothing if not egalitarian. The King of Avarice accepts your humble offering. You stand before Mammon's Picklock, latchkeeper of the Nine Hells. Ah! My business is not information, nor hellish curios. Not really. I break people into the Hells. <laughs> That's my thing. I can reveal to you that I opened a portal for Lord Gortash. <laughs> Raphael told me the crown of Carthus was stolen from Mephistopheles. Raphael. That sounds vaguely familiar, but I have a terrible memory for names. The only thing that jogs it is coin. I will kill you. <laughs> I'm gonna be patronizing. Oh, come now. Don't be miserly. I literally already gave you so much. Fine, here you go. I mean, I suppose that'll do. Stingy bastard. I fuck you. Yes, you are quite correct. The Crown of Carsus left the vault, and an opportunity opened for a devil named Raphael. His house of hope is furnished with a great deal of treasures, many related to Carsus. But alas, he lacks the crown itself. He's rather ambitious. One can only wonder what he has planned for the crown. The answers to that can probably be found within his house. Okay. Perhaps it's time we paid Raphael a visit. Can you help me break into the House of Hope? What a fascinating proposition. Ludicrous, of course, but fascinating nevertheless. Very well. If you wish to die in Avernus, that's your business. Mine is charging you for it. Christ. Of course, such a task will require quite the Twenty thousand! I don't have that money! Offers. Such a task would be tantamount to suicide. Do not even entertain it. I don't even have that money. Yikes. Shit. Let me tell you what happens if Raphael even suspects I'm poking around his home. I'll be scattered across the hells like a broken snuffbox. The price stays. Shit. Then get out of my sight, and don't come back until your pockets drag with gold. Shit. Well, we're not getting in there. Fuck. Oh, the gods truly this petty. Well, there's nothing here. Yep, well, I, I, I don't know how the fuck I'll ever pay for that, so, um, shit, dude. I'll never have that much money. The Gazette never prints anything that'll affect us regular folk. Some lunatics enter the city, and suddenly it's... It was another day in the City of Lies, Baldur's Gate, where the people begged for justice, until they starved. Two heroes were fated to cross paths that day. Their eyes met. Destiny was calling. Strangers? Only in a fool's definition of the word. It was the start of something incredible. Two heroes on the hunt for justice. No matter the cost. All the tall one had to do was say yes. The tall one had failed the first test. <laughs> they lacked caution. 
The cat could have just as easily been a foe as a potential friend. Aww. Perhaps it was simply not meant to be. No! I lost! I'm losing! Over and over and over again! There's no win! The novel's sense of intrigue was its finest quality. Don't get me wrong. The book intrigued me. In all the right ways. Oh. That, that will fit in my pack. Well. So here's the question. It says here, investigate Casador's place. How do we get there? Sorry, I don't know my pl my way around here. Let's take a look around. Get up here. Oh, oh, I really liked what the author oh, did oh, with oh. Catherine's tools are still here. I agree. Maybe he's coming back. To where Cal could never leave them behind. So She's all where are you going? Well, Can't get there. Adventures are basically worth nothing. Missions to reason some of them would side with the man who thought it paid well enough. What difference does it make? Cults come and go, and so do adventurers. Pat has interrupted Not enough. <gasps> Let's go. Oh! You could have just gone through here. Calm down, but go louder than the fire. Now, where are they? Okay, let's go. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. I can sneak in. The security shouldn't be too tight. A few charmed innocents, maybe. Yeah. I think we can get the wall built. Just the two of us. Okay. <laughs> oh. This is the palace of Casador Zar. Entry is forbidden. Leave now, citizen. Uh oh. The guard's words are clear, but spoken without thought or intent. Behind her eyes, you see nothing. She must be one of the charmed thralls Astarian mentioned. I... Oh no, I'm really bad at this. Oh, this sucks. Oh, thank God. She pauses for a moment. But keeps her mouth shut. It seems you're free to enter. Phew! Oh. <clears throat> Another guest. Yes, yes. More bones to chew, more bodies to nibble. Damn, I can't believe that us intimidating them so hard actually worked. Slim pickings up here, but safe. No one grabbing. No one biting. 
Where are people? Oh, oh. In the guts of the palace. Right. Hungry mouths down. The Starian did mention that. Yeah. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? Forcing the the thralls to chew on insects and you, you, you one of them, the fangy ones. Uh, I don't think so. Don't like when they change. Get big, hairy, mean. Make sure you stay away. I just realized I don't actually know what Cazador looks like. Which is interesting. Memories, uh, these rules uh, do not fail to follow them. Do your job silently, do not speak unless spoken to. The master likes it quiet. If you are not busy, find something to do and look busy. The master likes diligence. If you encounter the master, stand still and cast down your eyes with deference. The master likes to be respected. No whistling. Hmm. Well... With how they are, with how Astarian explains him. So, Astarian, vampire dens. What should I expect? Vampires would be a safe bet. <laughs> Hilarious. You belong on stage. Perhaps the bloodstained sort, with a hooded man standing by, axe in hand. Jesus Christ! As long as there's a cheering crowd. As for vampire dens. I brace your nose. Uh, they can be very organic. I love these two. This entire group is wonderful. <laughs> cool. Vampires, huh? Awesome. Love that for us. Well, that's suspiciously welcoming. Oh no! Ah, he knows we're coming! Ah. Do you have anything to say? So this is... There's the same fading carpet. The same tasteless art. Nothing has changed. But God's... Everything feels different. Are you sure about this? You don't have to face him. <laughs> I've never been less sure of anything. But if I don't face him now, I never will. I'll spend the rest of my life running, watching the shadows, never feeling safe no this has to happen here and now also there's a small matter of all that power I can steal from the bastard so that'll be nice mm. what's it like being back it does feel strange breaking into your own home Especially if murder's on your mind. Then again, this is hardly the strangest thing we've done together. Although it could be the most satisfying. Oh. Well, the second most satisfying. Uh-huh. 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 Oh, no. It's much worse than that. They're fanatic. Here of their own free will, and utterly devoted to Cazador. Each one came to our door, and begged to be given his eternal gift. They're sure he'll turn them if they serve him well enough. He'd almost feel sorry for the poor deluded souls. But they're idiots, who brought this upon themselves, so don't. Oh. 
What's the plan? Well, I was thinking first we find Cazador and then we kill Cazador. <laughs> That's about it, really. We can workshop the details as we go. <laughs> That's uh, pretty good. <laughs> then ask. Quickly. Um. Us. Give me one. Still give me a kiss. <laughs> There is nothing. Let's go. Let's kiss in the vampire den. Let's go. Let's fucking go. <sighs> Delicious. Base plan. Base plan. The best plan. What if we turn on the lights? Mmm. Yes. Hello. The master is pure. His palace must be pure. No stain, no smudge, no taint. Pure. Oh no. What are we rolling for? Bless us, master. May we be one. Oh dear. Guys, I am so scared for this, I'm gonna be honest. is covered in intricate text with rats you can't see anywhere a key might have fit only a small round hollow engraved with a family crest yeah we're not gonna do that shit the writing means nothing to you you can't even recognize the script there's writing like this all over the palace some old, probably dead language of Cazador's. We were strictly forbidden from learning it. Well, it's literally what's engraved on your back, so... Oh, critical success! The indentation seems to be the right size and shape to fit a signet ring bearing the family crest. Hmm. Well, fuck that painting. The inscription on this bust reads Mordok Salanmir. One of Casador's ancestors, perhaps? Who's this guy? Everything must be clean. Everything must be perfect. Another guest for the master's celebration. I'm afraid you're too late. You'll have to... Master Astaria. What are you doing here? Why aren't you downstairs? Oh, Christ. Well, obviously I'm on my way down now. So if you could just point us in the right direction. But you're too late. The, the, the doors have been sealed. The ritual is about to begin. But... Don't they need a Starion for the ritual? That doesn't make sense. Does that mean he knows we're coming? It's too late. Godi has sealed the doors and will not open them until the ritual is complete. Casador gave the key to Godi. And where is this sadistic old sack of bones? It does not matter. You're too late. The master will be so angry that you missed the ritual. He will do such terrible, terrible things to you. I do not have any more time to waste. There is too much to do, too much to prepare. Oh, Christ. Two centuries walking these halls, and I've never once seen the ballroom door locked. Cazador doesn't want anything going wrong tonight. Well, who's this Godi? Why does he have the key? He's Cazador's skeletal right hand. He kept us in line when Master didn't feel like torturing us himself. If Cazador's going to trust anyone to lock the doors behind him, it'd be that rattling old carcass. Godi kept us in kennels downstairs. 
The master ruled everywhere else, but they were his domain. Feels like we really should be killing everybody here. If Cazador's hiding anywhere, it'll be behind the huge locked doors covered in secret writing. Our old kennel master, Godi, will have a key. But the writing... I've no idea how to read that. It really is fucked to know that, like, Astarian got treated with, like, most of the others, like, tr like a literal pet. Or a, a mutt in a cage. It's just... makes me uneasy. Makes me sad. Elegant robe. Boxer hears anything. Time to rage. Oh. Hey, what do you think I look like? Do I look good? Oh, oh, this also looks really good on her. Hold on, keep that. Oh, she looks so gorgeous. Seems the Flaming Fist Mercenary Company has compiled a great deal of information on Nine Fingers and her crew, known as the Guild. Some heavy named Tuscans guarding some entrance the Fist are intrigued by. In fact, a very detailed account of the Guild's muscle and your note, a tide of derision from the fist. Evidently, they don't find uh, Tuskrant and criminals like him too bright. Not the sharpest scalpel in the surgeon kit, but nine fingers of her, they write in sullen, fearful tones. Chamberlain Dufay. The Kozakuran dictionary used to train new servants on how to operate the ballroom door has gone missing. And my signet ring alone won't do the job. Please have the servants sort this out. It couldn't be my problem to solve. Godi. No, I could do this different handwriting. Godi. The servants and I are thoroughly busy preparing for Master's celebration. Get your bows out of the kettle and search every chamber of the vamp vampire spawn level and quickly find that book. A ledger listed and tracking inventory of goods and regular use at the Tsar Palace. With categories for food, drink for servants and guests, cleaning supplies including alchemical bloodstain remover from bone cloaks, opaque heavy curtains, candles of different sizes in yellow tallow and red and black wax, leather straps with buckles, bombs and oils, and regular deliveries of Baldur's Mouth broadsheets. Huh. That looks like it's a door. Oh! My darling Dufay, despite all your promises that when we went to the afterlife we'd go together, you went without me, or did you? I found your body and the empty bottle. I know you took a potion, but was it poison or something else? Here are two more identical bottles. I'm going to drink one of them, and then I'll join you. One way or another, I love you for eternity. Whatever killed this werewolf burned it up from the inside. A werewolf? Its throat and innards are more liquid than solid. Walls. Interesting. Oh. Quietly, anyone could be listening. Okay. Something over there. 
Diary of Edwin Dufay, Chamberlain of Casadoy's Palace. The final page of the diary reads, I know enough about what the Master has in mind with his ritual that I refuse to be the stand-in for that missing Brad Asterian. Even if Casador finds my body, the potion Bone Cloak sold me is promised to provide a convincing illusion of death, especially since I'll leave behind a look-alike potion of acid poison. My one regret is dear Luriana, but I simply cannot trust her with the secret of my one chance of escape. When the potion wears off, Casador will have ascended and will have needed my and will have need of my services, or he will be no more, and mastery of the palace will fall to me. Ooh. Oh, I'm feeling sickly. I'm feeling very sickly. I'm feeling unpositively very nervous. For my beautiful boyfriend, lover. Ugh. What the? Necrotic energy. Best avoided. Can you bless it? Can you... What a day. Ignis! Ignis! What the... Okay, you know what to do. To go still. Where is it? Come on! Day of It's sapping my oh. strength. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, the bedrooms. Never once slept in. This is where I took our guests. I'd entertain them here until Casador appeared. And took them away. No one ever died here, though. Something strange happened to that girl. Victoria, remember to read that ancient language book. You'll need to know some of the vocabulary to be able to move freely within the palace, Father. Okay. What now? The more I hear Asterion talk about this area, the sadder I get. No one back home will ever believe this. The woman's eyes are alert, verging on manic as she bustles about. Everything's got to be right for the master. Everything's got to be perfect. Careful, I might. Let's crack it open. Critical success, really. That's the same outfit. Oh. Del Delria's private diary. Before I was Daluria, vampire spawn slave to Casador Sar, I was Dr. Daluria, physician general to the Parliament of Baldur's Gate. Spawn or no, I'm still Dr. Daluria, and I will not submit to this lowly status. The other say vampirism is a curse, but in my educated opinion, it's a disease, and therefore must be vulnerable to medical treatment. I believe a massive infusion of fresh, youthful blood may overwhelm the vampirism infection and enable my body to heal. There is one potential source of such blood here, Victoria, the as yet pure blooded daughter of Leon Onufrio. Leon was a sorcerer before he was a vampiric slave and has warned us not to prey upon Victoria as he has imbued her with a cure or counter curse in the event of attack. 
Made her a necrotic booby trap, as it were. I think Leon is. Jesus Christ! What to do? What Fucking to God! Suddenly, I'm even happier that Astarian is out of there. Oh my god. The hellish landscape. Behind it is the kennel. A fetid little cell he'd throw us into when displeased. Hmm. I missed a book in that bedroom, did I? Completely. The book is a dictionary of ancient Kazakuran language from a distant land of Kartu. Flipping through the pages, you find certain words and phrases underlined. Open, enter, beware, forbidden, sealed. A dictionary of an ancient language? Hardly surprising for a vampire's lair. Okay. What's over here? Alright. Oh, no. I hate. Wolves. I didn't realize you were frightened of wolves, Shadowheart. Wait, why is this only now coming up? I suppose you've noticed I'm not terribly fond of wolves. It all stems from that childhood memory, I suppose. It's strange. I now know that it was my father I saw, yet still... I can't suppress the fear. I suppose fear doesn't have to be rational. But maybe, given time, I can put it behind me. Everyone's got their own fears, I won't judge you. You're unlike the Mother Superior, then. Maybe that's what I like about you. You're different. Aw. Alright, let's go into the fucking lair, I guess. Looks like an ambush. Hi, motherfucker. I know you're there, Golly. Stop skulking and show yourself. You always were sharp, little one. Sharp enough to cut yourself. It's taking everything I have not to grind your rotten carcass to dust. <laughs> Don't be mad at Cody, child. I only did my job. Only kept you in line. You tortured us. For days at a time. Oh, yes. And you sang so sweetly for me. None of the others screamed like you did. But you're home now, and you brought me He's a so treat, furious. Eh? <laughs> a new friend for Godi. Oh, you little fucking bastard. Okay, I think I can do it, even though I really want to kill him. Okay, killing it is. That's fine. Oh, no. No, no, no. Godi is not worried by your threats. Godi has seen so much worse than you. Oh, oh. things have changed, Godi. We might surprise you. I doubt it, little one. Come. Let's hear you scream one last time. I would like to rage! 
Get fucked, nerd. Oh, I'm gonna savor this so hard. Oh! Easiest kill of my life! Action Eco. You shitty little bone guy. You are so dead. Oh. Oh. Let's go! There's an inscription on the ring. Looks like the same language as that book from earlier. <laughs> Everything we need to open the ballroom door. So let's not waste time talking. Oh. Cazador's hiding somewhere behind that door, and I'm going to find him. Should mind. Sorry. Okay. Stop. See. No more squeaking. No more rat lie. I have something to ask. I must be busy. Busy, busy, busy. Master might see me. Master might approve. Stupid fools. Sit. What's in here? This is where the spawn were kept. When we were getting neither the carrot nor the stick. Cazador's finest. When you're on the hunt, take prey by preference from the city's lower classes. Patriarchs may smell better, but it will attract unwanted attention if too many aristocrats vanish when they're out slumming. In the last month, you already brought in Dlusker, a Jasso, and an Uthon. And now we're wealthy families up in no, arms. Watch it. Master favors wolf, not rat. Master not feed wolf to stupid Keep stomach. away from me! Where do you see a wolf? He, the garlic in you since Ben gave him a nasty rash. This isn't right for being such a whining runt. Now, if only I could get at that snob Leon, his brat of a daughter. But he's protected. Kaiser must have a fine plan for little Victoria. I wonder what it is. Stop! No more squeaking. No more rat lies. I wonder if the 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 wolves are above here. Yeah. She's she's going through it, man. Okay. Diary of Leon Unafraid. Final page. Ever since the master Alpha make turned me and forced me to bring Victoria Long into the plaza. I've had to be his best hunter yet, so I could stay in here with my daughter and keep her away from the other spawn. I don't like the way Violet looks at her, not at all. When I ask the master what he plans to do with Victoria, Cassidy just gives me that wicked smile. Next time I get out on a hunt, must talk to Figaro to finalize the deal for Victoria's escape disguise. If only there's enough time before the rituals the master talks about. Favorite spawn... Uh, Kazador's best prey hunters who are entitled to stay in the special bedchambers year to date. Leon, Leon, Violet, Leon, Leon, Leon. Alright, it's time. Let's go, Asterion. Let's see you do your little, your little thing. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. I'm so terrified. I'm so, I'm genuinely so scared. There is so much to do, so much to prepare. Okay. Oh, oh, that put the 
wind back in my sails. The door remains sealed. Looking closer, you recognize the writing. It's the same Kozakuran script from the dictionary you found. Here we go. The ring slots perfectly into place, and the door swings open. Casador never kept guard dogs before. The runaway spawn. You reek of the master's scent. Come with us. Come to master. Uh, excuse me. I will not be ordered around my own house by some blowing mutt. We bring you to him. We get his favor. Oh, yeah, baby dot. Okay, so ah, 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 let's find some prey. Fuck yes, let's go. To do it. And let's go. I can't even catch my breath. All right. Um, all of them have a lot of health. I think you can take me on. Let's get the let's yeah. let's get rid of the small guys. Okay. This is fine. Oh, shit. Okay. There's a lot of bad here. Sorry, Karlak. Um... Tadpole charm. Nice. A 
starry and just can't be hit. One more time for the gods. Okay, dead. Cool. How's it going? Uh, let's kill the you. And then let's... Fuck you. Shit. Okay. So much for peace. Alright. They're both equally almost dead. Okay, let's hit you with this. Nice. We're all doing pretty good. Gaping wounds. Casador's nearby. I can feel it. He'll have some secret room or tunnel, I'm sure of it. We just have to find the entrance. Then he'll be mine. Can we leave? So I can at least heal? Also, what's wrong with you? With haste. Oh, that was just a bug, I guess. Mm. Quick, let's uh, let's get out of here so I can rest. He's. Uh, are the gods truly this petty? Well. Uh, are the gods? Yes. Yes, they are. This is, uh, this is... I'm ready to rest my weary head. All right, time to just sleep. Good night, everybody. Good night. Dude, I'm so fucking nervous for this fucking upcoming battle. I trust Astarian. I really do. But do I? <laughs> But do I? <laughs> and so close the doors. There's nothing here. Ugh. Okay, let's have a look around. Oh. Part 
tea planner. This seems to be working notebook used by a certain Chamberlain Dufay to plan Cazador's gatherings in a mansion ballroom. Functions are divided into two categories, those for invited guests and those for involuntary guests. The entertainment for the latter category being considerably more sinister than the former. The final handwritten entry is below. Master has ordered a special party, a final feast. He said this will be my ultimate test, but I am prepared, and I'm sure the guests, both invited and involuntary, will be thrilled to participate. Hmm. Do you like the congealed blood, Starian? Uh, I'm feeling sick to my stomach, dude. This is- I'm being so overly dramatic over a fucking fictional character. He's not real. Sansi, I've been invited to play at a party at the Sar Palace tonight in their ballroom. Show the Chamberlain at the door of this note and he'll let you uh, in to join me. Wear your best dress. Hmm. Ah! No! No, that's an iron adder. Well done getting that creep off Dame Aileen's tail. The last thing she needs is more trouble dogging her heels. What else do you have to say? Soldier? Nothing. Okay. Not not the fact that we're well. What is this place? This seems ominous. On my 13th birthday, I was summoned to the city palace by Uncle Cazador. Old Drossel hitched the team to the best carriage and drove me to Black Dragon Gate, where I was met by porters and a little, uh, and a litter to carry me through the upper city to Tsar Palace. The Chamberlain was waiting to conduct me to the ballroom, a chamber mysterious to me, as I'd never been allowed to enter it before. Shake music for General Sandro's death suite, a funeral celebration in three parts. Okay. Ugh. Oh. The inscription on this bust reads Shiresa Rune Master. Whoever that was. Stand on a clean metal platform, a beautiful but antiquated elevator. There are some scuffs to show its age, signs of things dragged onto it over the years, but it seems to be in good working order. What in the hells? I never knew this was here. This was always Cazador's private quarters. Only he ever came in here. Well, him and the unfortunate souls we brought to feed him. Well, let's go. Oh, I'm feeling really on. I'm feeling really not good. 
really good, really not good, really awful, really, really bad, really what ungood. I never knew any of this was here. This is all so grand. To think, it was just sitting here, lurking under the floor. I don't know. It feels older than that. Who knows how old? The Cazador will want a grand space for his ascension. A venue like this feels perfect. Now we just need to see what lies at the heart of this place. Mm -hmm. like the door to the ballroom upstairs. This door features no keyhole. It does have an indentation for a signet ring. The ring slots perfectly into place and the door opens, assailing you with pungent, musty air. Oh, what is in the other rooms then? Oh, you gotta be shitting me. It's a maze? Oh, God. What in the fucking seven hells? What the fuck? Approaching the cells, you're met with hollow-eyed faces. There's an almost physical stink of decay and neglect. Is this how you used to live a starium? <laughs> Hardly. Cazador didn't keep me in luxury, but I've never seen anything like this. How did they get here? What is Cazador doing with them? I should have guessed there was more to it than Raphael would ever have told. Yeah. You. I know you. You're the one from the tavern. You smiled and joked and got me drunk. <laughs> no. You're dead. You called me so many sweet things. My name sounded like a lyric on your tongue. Oh my God. Sebastian. You remember me. You were handsome. Shy. You'd never been kissed. You taught me how. And then you destroyed me. It really does kind of fucking suck that we have the same haircut. <laughs> It's not just him. I know so many of these faces. They're my... conquests. I pursued them. Seduced them. And brought them to Cazador. He told us he was feeding on them, but he turned them to spawn. He turned every last one so we'd have souls for this cursed ritual. How long? What? How long have I been down here? One hundred and seventy years. You were one of my first. My family. My friends. They're gone. You took them from me. 
You took everything from me. There's no escape. No escape for us. And no escape for you, Astarian. This nightmare never ends, and it's your fault! You did this, damn you! I damn you to the hells! I damn you to misery! Hear you. I should have known what Casador was capable of. Ah, he's played us for such fools. Not just seven spawn to placate the devil, seven spawn and seven thousand souls bound to them in blood. Everyone who ever trusted me enough to let down their guard, innocents, idiots, <laughs> and the unlucky. It doesn't matter. I will need to sacrifice them all if I want to perform the ritual. <laughs> What's the point? They're as good as dead. I thought they were dead. If they are unleashed, Cause incredible carnage. They will be ravenous. They must die. Better they serve a purpose. Oh. Ouch, that first one. Oh, fucking Christ. I don't want to say that, but fuck ow! Gods, I can't say you're wrong. I can only say I'm so glad we didn't meet then. I don't even want to think what would have happened to you. Oh, that one hurts. Oh, no. Many of them are petty criminals, street drunkards, and brothel goers. But from time to time, there was a Sebastian. My heart's ripping in two. Oh my god, are you kidding? Well, you clearly want to say something. I'm not sure. I've been weighing my options. On the one hand, they're the key to my unlocking eternal power and freedom. On the other, well, it's my fault they're here. Yes, it was Cazador's command. I had no choice, but it seems now I do. I'm sure I will. <laughs> Whatever the hells that might be. I 
I feel sick. <laughs> I feel so sick right now. Like the door to the ball. But he can upstairs. still laugh, crazy this guy. Door features no keyhole, but does have an It tells that you have absolutely no window. character reading, like at comprehension. He's clearly laughing because he's like, it's it. Sometimes you go, sometimes you just laugh in these situations. It doesn't mean you think they're funny. The ring slots perfectly into place, and the door opens, assailing you with pungent, musty air. It has... it's... it's... this is making me so... horribly upset. What the fuck is in here? This is a very good, very good save file name! Why is true? On the pillow rests a skull with a scroll clamped in its bony jaws. The skull's empty eye sockets flare with an eldritch gleam. You feel invited somehow to witness the skull's memories. It seems urgent. Okay. This skull is all that remains of the vampire Velios. He turned Casador, gave him the gift, and then taught him the rules of vampiric existence. Oh. Velios' first lesson is always to dominate. Allow none to be your equal. Valioth recalls when Casador reached out to a former friend. His punishment was to watch as Valioth drained his friend dry. Fuck. You were distracted by an errant thought and lose the ah. thread of Velioth's lesson. Yep, that is Voxer, Veliot all right. recalls when Casador rebelled against him. Casador suffered 11 years of impalement because he failed. Please, Voxer! Yay! Critical success! Veliot's third lesson is to act not in haste. A near immortal has time to plan. Time to act only when others will pay the price of action. Velioth recalls Casador, his lessons learned, killing him in the rite of perfect slaughter. How they both laughed. Velioth recalls Casador boiling the flesh from his skull. What and the then fuck? to mock him, clamping his schooling scroll in Velioth's jaws. The skull's eyes flash a final time, and its jaws sag open. The scroll with all of Casador's rituals is yours. Velioth is no more. Even his precious runes. <laughs> well, you clearly want to say something. Alive? <laughs> no. But animated? Yes. I'm sure they are. If Cazador turned the victims we brought him to spawn, he'd have done the same to the children. With glee, I imagine. But let's not forget why we're here. Cazador needs to die. Everything else comes second. <laughs> well... You clearly want to say something. I had no say in the matter. It was my master's command. I could feel guilty, happy in the knowledge there was nothing I could have done differently. I could never have saved them. 
But now... Now there's a choice to make. I'm... Yeah. <sighs> I trust him. I trust him so very much. I suppose, as you say, that you have reason to be proud of the expansion of the vampire circle in your city, of course. Uh, of course, Athkatla is more hom homogeneous than Baldur's Gate, and you face fewer challenges from the faction and law enforcement. But still, accept my kudos on your progress there. Enjoy your success while you can, Alcum, for I'm afraid that very soon it will be surprised my situation in Baldur's Gate, definitely so. The Definitively so. I'm on the verge of a long plan transformation entirely changes the rules of the game. Too long have I been content to merely a major city's vampire lord when I can be so, so much more and I shall. But that's all I say about the matter at present, young Alcum. After all, we mustn't give away the surprise entirely. I kind of feel like crying. <laughs> that's how I feel right now. I kind of feel like crying. Oh, come on! This vampire spawn has disadvantage on all saving throws while in a place of traumatic memories. Hey! Hey, you! Come closer. Oh, God. It can't be. It is you. I knew it. I'll kill you. Once I get out of here, I'll kill you! Ha camp! Monster hunters! Uh, the girl camp! Oh, God! My parents' camp! Uh, Chessa, focus! Resist the beast in inside you! Uh, you promised! Uh, it's your fault! You did this to us! Didn't he tell you? He's the one that kidnapped us! He's the reason we're spawns! Uh, I'll kill you! Uh, <laughs> yes, now that you, um, <laughs> mention it, uh, I may have done that. Oh, don't look at me like that. Casador's orders. <laughs> Quite the deviation from my usual routine, of course. Uh, capture, not lure. Uh, I didn't bring them in with sweet rolls or anything. Oh, God. I really the forgot about please. Them. Felt nothing the moment I handed them over to him. Oh. Parents? You've seen my parents? I miss them. I, I think. Or perhaps it's the hunger. Oh, I don't know. It's so hard to tell. You should go. Leave us here. We shouldn't be out there. We'd hurt our families. Behind the exhaustion, starvation, and fear, recognition stirs in her eyes, and with it, hope. You... you really mean it? Uh, uh, Casador's got this stuff. It controls the doors. If you get it, you can set everyone free. If you get it, somehow. Please. Whatever you can do. What are you doing? They're going to tear me to shreds. They'd never forgive me for what I've done. Yeah. Deep down. 
now and he deserves it. Kind of. But honestly, Cazador deserves it more. I just... I never want to see these little scraps of misery again. The world doesn't need to know my shame. Yours neither. They're all red. That's like the one thing that like I, I see people be like really kind of weird about. It's like I don't know. What's the the answer? What's the fucking answer? Like he a, a Starian could literally do nothing about it. He was literally mind controlled. He did not have a say in the matter. But in the end, it's still him. But in the end, it's Kazador. Except that a Starian lives with all of the fucking guilt. I don't think it was a case of him dying or surviving. I don't think he had- he, he couldn't even run away if he wanted to. clearly want to say something oh yeah of course like right now he has the choice and he's being weird about it <laughs> bro's going through five layers of hell right now like the most basic ass vampire that's really funny there he is oh there's leon oh that's titties oh my god those are boobies <laughs> that scared the living shit out of me. my nudity is off wait hold on i need to check this shit out those are just straight out boobs right there. Yep. Those are just straight up tits, man. Well, I guess in this instance it doesn't matter, does it? Okay, here we go. Dude, I'm fucking terrified. Who stands before us? Is this truly our prodigal son? Hm? Do not slouch before me, boy. Have you no respect for yourself? The hatred in Look him. Look at you. Crawling back after abandoning your family. You should be begging our forgiveness. Forgiveness? You've never forgiven anything. Every mistake, every slip was punished. I strove for perfection in all things, even those as imperfect as you. A pity you amounted to so little, despite my efforts. No. No. Fuck you. And fuck everything you've ever done to me. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I suspected you would return to me changed. Never did I imagine you would be so wretched. Nice staff, bro. Oh, thankless child. 
Did I not bless you with our immortal gift? Did I not make you what you are? You son of a bitch. Oh, oh Christ. You truly forgot my power. You truly thought our bond as creator and creation was all that stopped you from killing me? Hmm? Oh, you are weak, my child. You are a small, pathetic little boy who never amounted to anything. <laughs> But today, you will finally do something worthwhile. You will burn, and I will ascend. Oh, Christ. I, ay 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 Okay, awesome. Uh, stop him. Get me out of this. We have a three-player fight. Let's go. Witness the birth. Of the Vampire Ascendant! F.K. Dominus! Fight on me, you must, but I am only growing stronger! Oh my god! Starian was actually naked in the cutscene, and now he's wearing his clothes again. Wait, Voxer will be in... Okay. Awesome. That could be actually really useful. Get rid of that. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, Voxer, I'm so sorry. Of course. 
Sorry, Carlac. I have oh, holy God. Oh, I have no idea. This is way too fucked up, man. paralyzed. <laughs> she got fucking demolished, dude. And then there's Kazador just doing like 5 billion damage.
forgiveness. You've never forgiven anything. Every mis... Nice trip. A pity. No. No. Do the cattle not know you, boy? You son of... Ah. Uh, okay, I guess that's just meant to happen. You? Okay. Fight on me if you must. But how do you... Do you have to, like, just help him out? Check this. Wait. I am not very smart. I am also very confused. I also don't get Forgiveness. it. No! no. Enough to rend the flesh from your Wait, that would Does this mean he can get knocked? Ah oh, fuck. Okay. Let's see if, if it actually knocks him away. And that would be horrible. I assume it doesn't affect him. Hold on. Can't last much 
longer. I didn't think it would actually knock him away. Oh, good night. confused. Okay. This is so ass. Ah, oh, she's gonna die. She's dead. Yeah. Oh my god, poor Carlax getting ruined. I just don't... I don't know how to free them out of this. It seems kind of impossible.
Sorry, Carlac. Hope your soul is in good uh. hands. I'm large now. Yikes! They're looking for a Starian. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. I can't believe we managed to get Asarian into the fight like that. That's kind of hilarious. Um, feels like it shouldn't have worked, but it did, so... I can't do shit. Okay. Oh! 
Wait, does he just fucking... Really? I don't get the puzzle. I don't get it. Well, I'm just stun locked now because I can't do shit. Our ritual is near complete. Can you feel its profane power? Does it have to do something with the car? Ah! Uh, I'm, I'm just. It's over. I'm just stun locked because of this fucking skeleton. I don't I've got you.
Shallow surrender. to suffer for everything you did to me! Let you win!
over there. Turn someone inside out.
slaughter. Don't touch me. Let's get going. Not now! Not when Kazadl's finally mine! Hurry to his coffin! It's time to end this. for you. Wake up! Get your hands off me, worm! <sighs> I'm not the one in the dirt. One last thrust. And I'll be free of you. I'll never have to fear you again. But if I finish the ritual you started, I'll never have to fear anyone. Ever. You think me a fool? That I would allow anyone to usurp me, speak the words, and ascend in my place? Hm? The runes I carved into your flesh bind you and all 7,000 souls to the ritual. Complete it, and those bearing the scars will be sacrificed, you included. You are simply a means to an end. I made you to be consumed. I am so much more than what you made me. I can do this, but I need your help.
Trust me. I know what I'm doing. These people died years ago. Trust me on that. All that's left are feral spawn, desperate for blood. If we release them, how many people will they kill? Tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. But if they die and I ascend, I won't have to rely on the parasite to walk in the sun. I'll be free. Truly, completely free. Isn't that what you want? can see those eyes you've seen so many times before pleading with you to help him. I need your eyes, in a manner of speaking. What do you think you are doing? I'm making what you made me. It was the parasite. Link your mind to mine. Through your eyes, I can see the scars on my back. And copy them onto his. You would not dare! I would. And I will. You will be consumed. And all the power you've lusted after... ...will be mine. At the cost of a lot of lives. It's not worth it, Astarian. Help me do this. Please. Please. I can't do this alone. Aero dance. Is... is it over? Yes. It's over. You can do whatever you want. As for those... Why do they have to show the tits? ...in the cells. If I don't get my freedom... Neither do they. It's over. I'm done with this. And I'm done with you. I would say good luck out there, but honestly... Shit, dude. <laughs> I hope you die, screw. No! Fuck! 
What am I supposed to do? No, this is the one thing why I really want to say is though, because like this is the only reason why I'm, I'm fucking. <sighs> Sorry, everybody who hates save scumming, but like this is I care about this too fucking much. I care about this way too fucking much. But if they die and I ascend. I won't have to rely on the parasite to walk in the sun. I'll be free. Truly. It's not enough. Completely free. It's not enough. All you can see are those eyes you've seen so many times before, pleading with you to help him. with fucking with advantage to the socks the socks the socks the socks the socks <laughs> but if they die and I ascend I won't Please. have to rely on the parasite to walk in the sun. I'll be free. True. Completely free. You can see the fear in his eyes, but also the hunger. The thick smell of blood in the air and the promise of power being so close is intoxicating to him. All he can see is the power of the ritual and the freedom that power brings. The freedom to do anything. To be anything. I can't. I, I think I came in at a bad time. I won't make this. I won't make this. I have Fox is the most unrisked character ever. The anti riz The checks are very the fear hard. in his eyes, but also the hunger. The thick smell of blood in the air and the promise of power being so close is intoxicating to him. Thank fuck, dude. You... You're right. I can be better than them. But I'm not above enjoying this. And then he does the killing again, yeah. So it's just the exact same thing. I hate how much, like, emotion there is behind this performance. It's really good. Uh. 
Is... Is it over? Do I have to look at the titties again? Is he... God damn it, why? <sighs> yes. He's gone. Thank what God they're cutscene tits. I hate that there's like mega boobs on my screen right now. It means you have a choice. You can hide here, living in the shadows like parasites. Or you could be more than what he made us to be. You can choose differently, of course. But the consequences are on your head. And what does it mean for them? Now, that's a better question. 7,000 spawn from ancient conquests to stolen children. Casador's staff controlled everything during the ritual. If it controls the cells too, you could decide their fate. I don't know if releasing a bunch of vampires into the world is a good idea. I don't know. I don't know what the right answer is. But just as Astarian said... If we release them, they might fucking kill the hell out of him. Dude, I'm fucking saving this. This is too risky again. Some sacrifices just aren't worth it. No. He's right. The poor wretches in the cells are innocent. They shouldn't have to suffer just because I... lured them here. Voxer looks so handsome covered in blood. It's not the right time. <laughs> They'll need someone to lead them. Take the tunnels into the Underdark. Find somewhere, well, not safe, but less perilous. What? No, we can't! Just try to keep them out of trouble. I... I think we're done here. Let's go. What path lies before me? <sighs> That's it. He's gone. After all these years, these centuries, it's really over. I'm glad you think so, because I'm not so sure. I just feel... numb. What I've lost. <laughs> what I've gained. It's all so much. And God, all those spawn. Free in the Underdark. I need some time, I think. I... Just to let it all sink in. Let's just go. This place reeks of death, and I want to feel alive again. Uh. 
I feel so sick right now. I feel genuinely so sick right now. Oh, hello. You killed one vampire, but released 7,000 of his spawn. Have you lost all sense? They were innocents. To kill them would have been an even greater crime. Uh, but if you do decide to go hunting them, know they include your children. They... Oh, they survived? Well, that depends on how you define survived, really. But they are free. They're making their way into the Underdark as we speak. This is... Difficult news. We will need to decide what it means. Thank you for what you have done. Slaying Cazador was a great justice. As for the rest, well, time will tell. Yeah, Neil's performance is actually phenomenal. I think I think his performance in Astarian is one of enough. one of the big reasons why he is my favorite character. I think the voice acting for him is just particularly amazing. Just... Jesus, holy fuck, man. I should probably start getting used to the shadows again. Who knows how long I have left in the sun. <sighs> Maybe. But even if I could control it, it's a dangerous game. I spend every day waiting for something to go wrong, for the tadpole to find some new trick, reassert itself, make me a slave again. Maybe never seeing the sun again is just the price of freedom. I think I do. Assuming we survive, of course, because a horrible <laughs> death is always just around the corner with you. There's something I'd like to show you, if that's all right. Something out in the city. If you want to sneak off for a cuddle, you can just ask. Oh, that's kind of cute. I want to die. I'll try to restrain myself if you do. Shall we? He's so cute. This oh. way. It's not far. The graveyard is appropriately silent. There isn't a proverbial soul around. <laughs> Stereotypical. Hold back for a moment. <laughs> I wonder if that is this his grave price his grave or is that nearly 200 years and I never came back oh yeah it is not since the night I woke up down there I had to punch a hole in the coffin and claw my way through six feet of dirt. Then when I finally broke the surface, retching up 
dirt and congealed blood. Cazador was waiting. From that day on, I was his. Until today. Maybe. But he did take it. There's almost nothing left of the person I was. Just a name on a rock. For nearly two centuries, I stalked the streets like a ghost. Well, the person I was lay here, dead and buried. Now I need to figure out who I am. What I want. I don't know if I want to say the first one or the second one because the first one is very like taking the moment away from him. If you catch my drift. And I feel like two just gives him that. Yeah, I let's let's see. I'm probably going to reload because I want to see what the first one says. <laughs> You. I want. You. You were by my side through all of this. Fuck! Through bloodlust and pain and misery. You were patient. You cared. You trusted me when that was an objectively stupid thing to do. Yeah, it was. I feel... Safe with you. Seen. And whatever the future holds for me, I don't want to lose that. Dude, these other two options are so fucked. Thank you. Well... I should probably fix this. for long enough. It's time to try living again. With everything that life has to offer. Oh, God! Christ, this is so gay! <laughs> You know, I didn't care for you when we first met. Yeah, I know. But I do now. <laughs> Being with you is about more than lust or manipulating you into a tactical alliance. I love you. I love this. And I want it all. 
Oh my, oh, get out, oh, oh! Insufferable, I love him! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Boxer happy is very nice. Maybe I should do it more often. The game isn't over yet. You're right. Everything that happened, playing it over and over in my mind. Invigorating, terrifying, all of the above. <laughs> I'm still trying to understand it, really. I came so close to losing everything back there. To losing myself. Back at the ritual, all I could see was the power on offer and the safety it promised. I was so blinded by it. <laughs> Just as Casador was. But you saw something in me. Someone else I could be. Someone who could break the cycle of power and terror that started <laughs> centuries ago. You saved me back there. I may not have appreciated it at the time, but I do now. Thank you. You did more than that. You... believed in me. Believed I was enough. Just the way I am. <laughs> when I look at my future, anything and everything feels possible now. And I get to share it with you as a partner. And... equal. You saved me from myself and let me walk a new path where I can be free. Truly, honestly, free. This is a gift, you know. Thank you. I won't forget it. I feel so pathetic for crying! <laughs> oh, 
I'll be damned, I don't care what people say. Astarian is an absolutely phenomenally written character. And it's just that Neil's performance just like elevates him as a character so high. And to see people say that he deserves nothing When you are a person who gets used and abused and are in no position of power for your entire life, of course you're gonna... Of course that's how you're gonna act. And it's just... I don't... I don't trust people. that think he deserves nothing because while he acknowledges that he he did all of this he couldn't do anything about it it doesn't make it right clearly but he made it right and i think i'm gonna be honest i think many abuse victims can relate Maybe that's why I relate. Being, being manipulated and abused really changes you as a person. And a, a, the, the worst part is knowing that a lot of people don't make it out either. The only reason I got out of the abuse that I was in is because friends helped me out of it. It's just so unintentionally powerful or intentionally powerful. I will never forget Baldur's Gate 3 for making me enjoy a vampire. I mean, in general, I don't really trust people who think that a flawed character equals a evil character. Oh uh, no, I'm I I dislike vampires. I never enjoyed vampires in media, which is why I wanted to like us. Uh, like when I heard when I played the the alpha when it came out, I was just really annoyed that he was a vampire because I hate vampires. I think the entire, like, sucking blood thing is, like, really, uh, and just, it's, like, annoying. <laughs> so, so, me liking Astarian was a real kick in the dick. <laughs> No, it's just everything really encompassing vampires I don't really enjoy.
Yeah, I... Man... I mean, to know that this is what it's like to go through Starion's, like, entire route with such a high focus on him, it makes me wonder... I mean, I'm pretty fucking sure that the other characters are written just as amazing. Because it feels like you really get to know a character a lot when you're devoted to them. There's still tears running down my face. God, I fucking hate this stupid bitch. Affectionately. I'm so insane. I'm insane for Starion. It's actually insane. I just know I'm going to rewatch this fucking scene over and over again. I hope there's nothing troubling you, my dear. Og! 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 My heart! <laughs> yes, my sweet? What is it? You can do this still. Especially after the complete devotion. They need to remove that. <laughs> Get it out of here! Throws it in the fucking trash! It would be nice not to have to rely on you as my great protector. <laughs> but, well, I do appreciate the thought. <laughs> God. These fucking homosexuals. Uh, you are perfect. Every time. Fucking homosexuals. I fucking hate this bullshit, stupid gay uh, vampire. You're so adorable when you're thinking what to say. <laughs> you little rat! Yes, my sweet? What is it? <laughs> Nothing special, of course. You're only the first person who I truly care for. Okay, I am existing. I am very fine. I am living. I am breathing. I am. I need to save. I need to save. <sighs> oh, that's a load. There we go. Gail in the corner like, it should have been me, not him. I, oh my god, I'm also not trying, I'm also trying not to be annoying because like, the worst part about this all is just, no, 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 you don't, you don't, you don't know what I'm about to say. Um, I, I'm just, the, the, the annoying part about me is in my head, I'm just like, oh, wow. 
this is humongous for Voxer of all the characters that I have. This is like the only universe where he falls in love with someone. The only one. It's the only one where he can be happy with someone. <laughs> Yikes. I have to play this to cleanse my head. It's not enough. We have a gallery of villains to look out for, but now we could be infiltrated by a shape changer. I can't even tell if any of you are acting strange because you've been replaced or because this group is full of weirdos. <laughs> I love that. I love that line delivery so fucking much. Oh, Christ. I, I don't I don't know what to say, guys. I've been playing for ten and a half hours and I feel my brain disintegrate. Oh, yes, yes, please. <laughs> really, Neil as Neil as a starian really sells. It is it is a perfect fit. You know the moment I'm gonna lay down, I'm only going to think about a starian and Voxer. And I'm gonna think about the fact that they fucked in front of his grave. And oh fuck! Someone said I should try it out, and you know what? Fine. As a, as a, um, as a little treat for everyone. We've screamed a lot today. Not only did we engage in tentacle sex for some fucking reason. We also engaged in weird devil sex and screamed. <laughs> we did it for the achievement. No other reason. Yes, the emperor tried to fuck us. And it was weird. It was weird. Is it right? It made me scream. Leave me alone. Oh, she's actually dancing. Okay. I don't understand why they're such a type. Of course you came back. I never doubted you would. Hold on. Let's see. Someone told me to do this. I'd like to try doing things like this again. Now I'm free to find my own desires. <laughs> and don't worry. I'll dart out if I don't enjoy it faster than I used to run from the sun. Please! <laughs> Cry! Cry! Being a friend to help the man, we will charge a little less. He's insane. <laughs> what was that left? <laughs> Let's go. This is thrilling. All right. Hold on, y'all need to go. Carlac, Shadowheart, you guys have fun whatever you do, girl stuff. Scissoring, I don't know. <laughs> Leave me alone. That's what girls do, right? So we have a group of gays and a group of lesbians. We're living the fucking life right now, dude. It's the sleep deprivation kicking in. Most probably. 
Also, um... Do we have to uncurse him, or is that just something that I have to deal with now? <laughs> is Astarian forever traumatized? <laughs> All right, let's see what this has in store. Oh, Christ. I'm not ready. All right, let's see what's going on. Quite the merry little party we have assembled here. Shall we? Uh. <laughs> Murmur a quick prayer under your breath that this doesn't break into a brawl. I hope you're not afraid of the dark, my darling. I must snuff out the lights before we begin. Oh, shit. It's all part of the experience. The room is bathed in total darkness, so there is nothing to distract from your ecstasy. They're just gonna turn out the lights like that. Yep. The lady, Nim. Moves your hand to where the clasps of her hands lie. All right, sweethearts. You dare to dance with a professional. You'll get your desire. Please! Jesus His Christ! Is like lusted pearls, almost translucent and so delicately smooth. He's so perfect. It could move even the toughest soul to tears. Okay. <laughs> it's so easy to see why that body alone ruined... Oh, so come on! <laughs> You're looking at me rather... curiously. Speak up. Narrator, that's fucked up! Tell us what you want to do. <gasps> oh! That's so cute. <laughs> me too. For this, I feel we should be paying you. Oh, oh my god! Astarian lavishes attentions on everyone present with flawless technique. D this Unfazed. dude's a whore. <laughs> it's all pure instinct. Astarian is a bigger whore moment, than Boxer. There's a look about him that reveals he's a million realms away. Good. Awesome. Yes, love. Yeah, that's just it. Is that is that it? Is, is that it? <laughs> Are you just a mega whore? <laughs> How are you out whoring the whore? Come on. <laughs> I was so hoping you'd say that. Until later, then. All right, let's talk. Who knows when we'll have another chance? Okay. He has a gift. Give me a moment, for pity's sake. You've exhausted me already. We recover quickly, but not that quickly. Okay. B bye. Um. Awesome. Let's let's go. Come on, you fucking cunt! Christ. He had 200 years, what else is he gonna do but be a whore? Yeah, I guess so. Christ. I can't believe this is just an enemies to lovers fanfic. I love it. I love that idea. Listen, I've said it multiple times before. The reason why I'm so into this working is because at the beginning, 
if it goes p completely by logic of I'm going back into the fucking long rest. I don't want to hear the people talk. That is not where I want it to be. What? <laughs> There's a dead kid there. <laughs> Let's leave, actually. Um, worst timing ever. Hold on, hold on. I need to, I just stun locked myself if I'm going to be honest. So Astarian didn't fulfill his master's ambitions for himself. At least that means he's his own man. Though, I'm a little surprised he didn't covet those powers. He'd hate to hear me say this, but I'm so fucking proud of Astarian. He could have had it all, but he kept his soul instead. I wasn't sure he had it in him, but he's changed so much. Overcome so much darkness. Oh, I could smooch that pointy little face. Ah, uh, Karlak, you are just perfect. You are so perfect. God. Next playthrough I do, I'm romancing her 100%. Holy shit. I, like, I genuinely want to date someone like Karlak IRL. Like, like a fucking... Like, absolutely... Actually, like... I think I'd be the happiest person in the world if I actually had had a SO like Carlac. I would I would become I would become an absolute like wife. I would become a housewife. Why are we still here? We're not fully in yet, I guess. Hold on. Um. There we go. But question is, Voxer or is Shannon? Oh, I don't give a shit about what Voxer thinks. I want her. <laughs> me, personally. Me, Shen. The person sitting here, behind the stream. Me. I... Desire her romantically so much. Do you want me to go super lesbian mode? God. It's so funny because like this sounds insane, but I personally wouldn't even go for Astarian. I love Astarian as a character, but I wouldn't romance him. I've been rooting for Voxer this entire time. But Carlac, dude! Out of the way, brother! That's my spot! <laughs> I will put every assassination attempt on Boxer to just be in Karlak's presence! <laughs> Christ. It's so funny, though, because, like, you don't actually need a fire resist potion for Karlak if you just play for, like, five minutes. <laughs> or at least you get to act, too. <laughs> Dude, when she can finally touch people, that was heartwarming. It was 
Soak. Soak. Moving in. The only problem is I don't like a lot of the fan art of the, that comes from Carlac because a lot of people, a lot of artists are people who are drawing her with the male gaze and it's like, that's not even Carlac, dude. You drew some fucking moe-ass girl. <laughs> Oi. Anyways, as I was saying, the, the reason why I'm rooting for the Asterian and Voxer romance so much is because at the beginning... Um, uh, sorry again for nerding out. Um, because at the beginning, Voxer obviously hated Astarian with a burning fucking passion. But that's because Voxer hates everybody, but especially Astarian because he's annoying. <laughs> you can't tell me that Astarian isn't annoying. In a good way. So, to have a character go from, to have their relationship going from I fucking hate you, to oh we're hate fucking, to oh god maybe I relate to this guy more than I do, to falling in love is like making my neurons activate. If I still had it in me, I would absolutely fanfic this shit. But Birdhaven awaits. And also my bed awaits. I'm so tired. Yeah. It was literally the oh god I like him moment for, for Voxer. Uh, I'm going to do a warning. I might not stream tomorrow. I could be lying. Who knows? I probably need to take a break. I'm very glad I managed to at least cap off a Starion for right now. I just decided to think about a starian again. Ah. Oh, tee hee hee hee. <laughs> Kicks my feet. <laughs> Anyways, please look at my stream time.